Obviously not Hello, everyone. Speed. How's everyone Hello. doing? Wow. Hey, guys. Sorry about that. I we were actually talking about the evolution of language and ethnology, mm -hmm. Brad. We Ooh, actually were. Ooh, that's kind of. But odd. you were too late for the conversation. Oh, sorry. Oh. I I don't. Oh, oh. I don't get to participate in this conversation. <laughs> no, saying. we're over it. No, we're done. No, mm -mm. We've moved on. We've we actually just wrapped up. <laughs> that's good. You know what? I think uh, I'm glad you guys are doing big brain smart stuff and uh and yeah so that's good <laughs> now we we're talking about keck w and <laughs> don't know <laughs> <all. laughs> we love we we're talking about people laugh and how language <laughs> i mean to be fair that is still part of the language conversation i feel like yes the council of geniuses at the twitch bar have uh started talking about <laughs> <Karen> <laughs> chat said oh it's this group and i don't know why but i read that with such disdain that sounds <laughs> yeah i i would have also oh. Honestly, I, these. I I also would have read it that way. Just, oh. <laughs> but it could easily just be like, oh, it's this group. Nice. Yeah, with an exclamation, exclamation mark. mark. But I instantly read it as just like, this guy's out of here. Yeah. Oh, it's this group. There you go. Yeah. All right. Can you guys say it with a smiley face? No, wait. I feel like the no, 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 that's, that's, that's worse. worse. No, that's, that's worse. So that is worse. worse. That is worse. Twitch language, the smile now is ruined. And so I don't smug. Take it for real. So fucking smug. Yeah, no. Wait, I, so I, so I, the smile is always facetious. Just... Uh, oh yeah. Yeah, I hate it. I no hate that. Or whatever. Although I do Pulling like I, I do like surprise as just a real goober e boat. Like there is some yeah. there well, is uh, well surprise is just colon D. Yes. Like the new version. Yeah. Yes. It's uh it's <clears throat> it's good. And it's got some stank to it, but I like it. I like it. <laughs> oh <laughs> this group. Fuck. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my god. I'm sure there was no stank meant with that, but still, that is a funny thing to, to say. Um, ah, damn yeah. it. Okay, there we go. Windows. I, you ever, um, have I? No, I talked about this with Deadbeats. Um, you ever shake a window in Windows Windows 10 or whatever you got, and everything just minimizes for a second? Yes. You, I think yeah. you can turn that off. I, I, I like it's, it. I like it though, just not when I'm streaming slash doing a D and D show, you know. Oh, uh, I wish you could find it to turn it off then. Yeah, that's true. Uh, anyways, <clears throat> let's go ahead and get started because uh, today's gonna be a really fun session. I can feel it. Uh, you'll, you'll notice that uh, Brulvec, the Herald <clears throat> of the Collector, has recently received a facelift. Uh, yes. He's a smug. He's as smug as ever. Look at well, that. Well, I have a question for you. Please, yes. At his neck, mm -hmm. is that arty spread eagle wrapped around his neck? <laughs> oh my. Is that what that is? God. No, it's really funny that you mentioned that because when I was talking to Bernard <laughs> yeah. about making Brulvec, I'm like, it's really important you get arty spread eagle across his neck. And he, he said, <laughs> say no more. He I mean, said, yeah. Say no more. I gotcha. <laughs> I was already halfway there. <laughs> I was like, that's a neat little touch. Yeah. Um, to, the real answer is no. No, it's not. No, but, uh, of course not, because he'll probably not be on his neck. Peter of the mind. So. <laughs> yeah. But... Also, I saw somebody mention, Benji, that you can't even make his head explode and that you're bluffing. Uh, well, uh, uh. Someone oh. said that you're a little liar and you're Someone. not enough level to detonate it, but go off. Whoever said so that has no idea what they're talking about. Someone's, no. someone's given the game away. We'll see. <laughs> uh -oh. Well, thankfully... Thankfully, the character doesn't know that because he's yeah, not Yeah, nobody hero, knows right? that. Yeah, you know well, what? I don't even know that. Hey, no, I got this, Benji. Hey, go to the Rules <laughs> Lawyer channel if you'd like to go ahead and say what Benji can and can't do. I'm on my way to swing I mean, the hands. best part is, is I don't know <laughs> how his <laughs> class works, so he could just lie yeah. about any ability in the game, and I'd be like, oh, you can do that, yeah. I just I just assumed he was bluffing, honestly, is what I, yeah, no, I, I, was, I thought. Uh, well, yeah. I'm bluffing, but I, also, to be clear, I thought he Artie had is a flamethrower, and it's yes. pointed at his chin, mm. you know? Mm -hmm. It which still is, wouldn't be a very fun which is yeah, which is still a, which is still a very bad time. You are correct about that. Yeah. Yes. Um, also, uh, as I look through the patch notes, uh, Kef has received a little bit of uh, warmth Nerf, to buff. his skin. Uh, oh, yeah. Whoa, very nice. Yeah, so that way people All the stop. Patch notes. People stop. <laughs> I, saying. I wish you could see those. Yeah, <laughs> love that. I'm, I'm reading them to you. You're just, you're just gonna have to trust me. Saturation he, he ten percent. Less sick. Yeah, I mean he's yeah. he's he's, he's an that. old pale guy, so yeah, that's the way it's gonna I'm not gonna he's not gonna just be this like yeah. blushed you know I'm gonna give Kev well, he looks I'm like not. Boromir Let's looking at the one room. 
to get a fake tan. Yeah, or <laughs> you guys can just give Kef makeup. Yeah. Or how about that? You guys, you guys can kind Kef of make makeup. episode? Yeah, I'm down. Give him, give yes. Him, powder his face. Do what you need to do. Fan art. Uh, fan artist, can we get Kef with a makeover with a little bit of blush on the cheek? Can we ossify him? Yeah, Kef do we have crystal powered tanning beds in Oh, th there it is. There it is. Uh, Yeah, probably. Like, should. Uh, Shar technology, absolutely. Oh, thank God. Yeah, you can the ossification of Kev. I can't wait for this episode. How, however, you are no longer on IO. Well, that might be true. Lundy, I'm sure, has all the technology we, we need. <laughs> I don't think Lundy has any. <laughs> does, uh, does Lundy have plumbing, Brett? I don't think... Does Lundy have a toilet system? <laughs> yes, Lund Lundy does have... Uh, pl plumbing does have a, okay, a little bit of energy. Okay, question. question. Yes. Do they just plumb the shit straight off the side of the floating islands? There is a small little area, not where the shit goes, but where, you know, the waste Wait, wouldn't they just, area. like... Uh... When they use it for Let like it fertilizer and stuff? No, they would not. They, use, they got the animals for that. That's they what got the animals animal are for. Shit. Yes, yes, yes. Um, there would be uh, a small, there would be a small little uh, waste processing area for Lundy. They don't just okay. shit off the side of the floating island. Yeah. I thought that. No, what? Well, if they pumped though. it all off the side, then yeah, where would it go? That'd be an interesting <laughs> yeah, question. Yeah, yeah. Just like floating around in a space somewhere. Yeah, <laughs> we could find that. Yeah, well, the big it's the shit same. Cloud. It's the same thing I get from people when we go to Clayberry and there's like junk scrap yards everywhere and people are like why not shove trash over edge of world just why not do that <laughs> it's like <laughs> there's some has there's some environmental hazards when you just push a bunch of junk off the side and it starts to orbit around these floating lands not a, not a good, absolutely uh, but do the people of Lundy know of that and do they care yes you know? The yes. people of Lundy are like us with plastic in the fifties. Yes, they 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 absolutely <laughs> care about that. Yeah. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. So otherwise, they just will be over, like floating over a, a giant junk pile. You know what I mean? Um. Okay. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> clearing my voice. Let's go ahead and get started with some Dungeons and Dragons. <sighs> All right. DM mode. Ah. Uh, uh, Hold on, I've got a hair in my eye. Okay, there we go. Wait, what the? Hold on, I have to clean my glasses. I'm distracted. Sorry. Clean glasses. There was like a strand of hair on the side of my glasses that was just hovering oh, over that's, my eyeball. Oh, that's infuriating. Yeah. yeah so I had to get, had to, had to get, get that out. Okay. Rubbing eye, and here we go. After a long rest uh, within this shadowy hellscape, uh, you guys awaken uh, within the ruins of this ancient ritual site, this ancient temple. The sound of conversation happening to the north of the temple behind the blocked and closed door. Scheming. Uh, scheming, uh, according to, 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 to Remo. Uh, Remo and Kopi listened in as individuals plotted to seek out who killed the rocks in the area. Remo, ready to wrestle, I put that in the notes, ready to wrestle, uh, was fired up. I think that's, that's, that's the term you used. I'm fired up. Uh, charged in and beat up a diplomat of the collector while Kopi murdered his two guards. Desperate for a solution, Brulvek, herald of the collector, Wait, recently- murdered, defended yes. Remo? Nah, that's not the news that was reported. Okay. <sighs> The narrative has been controlled. Let's let Brett tell us how it's <laughs> no, 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 no. in the world this, see it. This is why we, we we do this, so we can correct. All right, I will. So no, I like that. No, I like that a lot. According to Kopi, <laughs> defended uh, to <laughs> the eyes of Brulvek, brutally murdered. Uh, Brulvek revealed the identity of the uh, collector. Oh, wait, here it is. Oh, yeah. Brulvek, herald of the collector, attempted to make peace out of fear of being killed as easily as his guards were. Brulvek revealed the identity of the Collector, who was Mephistopheles, one of the original eight Lords of Shadow. Mephistopheles, a curious individual with potential ties to Io, mentioning that his palace was a beauty much like the Kingdom of Gwendolyn. So with hesitation, the party follows Brulvek as honored guests to the Palace of the Collector. Anything else you guys would like to add in before we... Uh move on that's your chance no. say no. your piece okay no 
Um, no, I just I I love the juxtaposition of these happy-go-lucky uh, Ghibli creatures mm -hmm. in oh, like hell. abominations in shadow is. hell. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we are like straight out of like a children's book. Yes. Yeah, I mean you'd think that looking at QB's face, but it, when you peer for <laughs> you just a second, into her look soul, into the eyes too long. Yeah, I know. You realize yep. something's not there. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. <clears throat> okay. So you guys have arrived at the Palace of the Collector. Ooh, let's go ahead and get started. So as you arrive, the, the wooden gates open up in this barren wasteland that is the Shadow Vale, and you are immediately surrounded uh, by these shadowy entities, these devils, the, the Umbrani race, uh, as well as Shadow Tieflings scatter about. Uh, the, big guy. the front area. That is a siege devil. Uh, he's just there Whoa. to maintain the peace. Doesn't mm -hmm. seem to be a... He has uh, a Giga Chad chin. Yes, it does. Uh, a Giga Chad devil. devil. No, he... Uh, <laughs> Yay. Yeah, he doesn't seem uh, much for conversation, but uh, as Brulvec walks you inside, the gate now open, uh, Brulvec will kind of give uh, like a... Uh, this sort of like flamboyant bow to you all. And he says, welcome to the uh, the jewel of the wasteland, the palace of the collector, where you will be honored guests. And you'll actually watch as like the guards are like looking around, trying to get a little bit of command. Brulvec will sort of like step forward a little bit, hold out his hands. They aren't hostile, I promise you. It's everything's good here. They're honored guests of the collector. And then he kind of like looks over to, uh, He'll look straight over to uh, to Remo, kind of give a wink, <clears throat> like a big old like, yeah, like we're we're friends now, right? Don't hit me. Don't so don't associate with me. Mm. Yes, of course. Uh, perhaps you would like a tour of our lovely city. I assure you, everyone is warm and welcoming. Uh, sure, but don't lead us down any alleyways. Of course not. However, we do need to squeeze by that alleyway over there. And he kind of like points nope. in that direction. <laughs> I mean, I suppose we could keep more to the open streets uh, where the lights are. Yeah, probably. Probably at first I'd be more comfortable with that. Uh, fair enough. Uh, don't be so suspicious. He tugs over at the uh, <laughs> party. What, what, what makes you think I'm suspicious? <laughs> Well, you know, this uh, beautiful piece of jewelry that you seem to have installed in the back of my neck. It's something is pre something something's pressing. Something's pressing against my neck. What is that? What is that? Ah, it, how he's like ho literally visibly holding a button in his hand. <laughs> how, what do you mean? What, what's the problem? Can <laughs> we get on with the tour? This guard I'm cold. This guard walks over to you guys. Is there a problem, Harold? And he just kind of uh, shakes his head and goes, "Up, oh, no problem at all. I, it's everything's thumbs up." And then he gives a two thumbs up over to the guard. The guard sort of like walks back over here and goes, uh, uh, "Right. Well, anyways, uh, this way, please. You guys are free to move about, or if you'd like, I can move your tokens. I can yeah. walk with my legs unless I go somewhere I shouldn't, and you freeze time." <laughs> Kef will walk over. He he look. He he'll, he'll just say. I feel like I've got a bit a bit more life back uh, in this old body. He looks at it, the color that has entered his skin. Albeit not much. Yeah, I would say the sun's been uh, good to you, but uh, we haven't been getting any. Yes, of course. Uh, you'll watch as this <laughs> lovely, happy-go-lucky man will, will walk up and he'll go, mm, Fresh meat. Tell me, uh, are any of you in in the mood for some games of chance? He holds up a set of dice. Bro, I just want to point out that these all look like Dragon Ball Z villains. Okay, cool. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> uh, he holds a compliment. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, only a compliment, compliment cuz Sam likes DBZ a lot. Yeah. yeah, I love it. He uh he holds up the uh the the two dice within his hands and he'll be like <laughs> new people in town. And you uh, favor a game of chance? Oh, I'd love to. 
Uh, Eyes uh, sparkling. Uh, <laughs> Kofi, uh, do you... Is this a good thing for you? Do you even have money? Rolvec will uh, hold up and he says, oh, uh, Now, now, we, we haven't even started the tour yet. Uh, he interrupts and just kind of says in a gruff voice, and he says, Money, no need for it. You have mm, energy, spirit, soul, yes? Just a little bit to gamble what with. What the hell? Wait, do we have... We have money? What, what? Don't we have money? You have... I don't uh, think that's what he wants. Credits or something. Right? I don't think he well, cares about money. I well, think he wants soul. So, mm. the, oh, the, cur it. the currency you have is currency that works within the keep uh, and with the veils that are connected to the keep. The shadow yeah, veil has... anything profitable. Oh, either. then Kobe doesn't give a shit then. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, I'm... Oh, forget it then. And she walks away. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> can, if we win, um, do we get some of your soul? Well, what if you, you can do with soul. If you're interested not in my, interested in soul. <laughs> if you're interested in my spiritual energy, I suppose I can offer it up. Or I can give you a precious fragment. And he holds up what seems to be an obsidian shard that has no relation to anything that you guys, but he looks at, at you as if he has just presented Midas's gold. <laughs> wow! Rolls your eyes. Whoa! That's a neat little doodad you got wrong. there. Don't you know what this is? No. 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 If you gather four of these, you get access to part of the collector's uh, that collection. Yeah, part of the collector's antiquities, powerful magical items that I'm sure you would be interested in. Rolvec just kind of interrupts our point. He says they don't know anything about that. Now, would you please let us move on? Can, Are we in a rush? Uh, can Sorry. we cast Mage Hand? <laughs> Reaches for the remote. Are <laughs> we in a rush? Uh, <laughs> you, the, while he's holding it in his hand? Um, yeah, and can I make it invisible? With okay. the ledger to me or whatever? Uh, sure. Uh, go ahead and roll me a stealth <laughs> check to attempt to grab something out of his hand oh that he's looking at right now. God. But he's looking oh my at god. The thing. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> You're not invisible. Well, she, maybe maybe she makes it look like the wind blew it out of his hand, and that mage hand like drags it along the ground. <laughs> um, yeah, you'll just kind of feel this this yank uh, come out of his hand. Uh, go ahead and give me an intelligence check. To see how powerful the mage hand is compared to his grip. Not saving throw. Check. Check. Okay. Uh, yeah, so you, he, as he holds on to it, he kind of looks a little bit confused at the fact that you don't understand the precious value of this fragment before it just completely pulls out of his hand and just falls down uh, to the ground and starts moving its way over towards you. He goes, what? And uh, yeah, he's just gonna immediately like charge over. Um, so, QB, what do you do as the rock is now just just gently floating over in your direction as you're holding out trying to trying to get the rock are you gonna make a move to grab uh, the fragment or what are you doing first she's gonna look in the other direction and say oh my gosh there's a bear behind you <laughs> please hold a deception check me. at a disadvantage because there are no bears in no this bears area. in the shadow realm. <laughs> <laughs> what the or, fuck is it, a bear? or in this palace where bears are yeah. clearly not Whoa, roaming around. My God. Okay, so he'll look over, and it's just for a brief moment of hesitation that he just says, What? And he will turn around. Oh, then she'll pick it up really fast and put it in her pocket. Uh, Bro oh Brovec God. is watching all of this with, like, Are you Boy, insane? Um, Slide a hand, please. Slide, slide a hand check, please. This is... Oh. What? <laughs> He's got slide baby, a... like, object permanence. Watch, it's gonna be a 20. Yeah. Where's... Oh, slide of hand, slide of hand, slide of hand. Oh, shit. So oh. as he turns back, he sees you, like, trying to, to rush, and you stumble for a moment as you lean down, trying to grab the rock. Uh, he kicks it out of your hand, and he says, Why, you good-for-nothing thief! Uh, the guards start to approach, moving oh in. Brolvec holds he out his hand. He gave it to me. Brolvec. He tried to give it to me. Bro he said, I did no such thing. 
Brolvec holds so out why his- why was it coming towards me? Brolvec holds out his hands. He says, now, now, everyone, let's go ahead and settle down. There clearly has been a misunderstanding here, uh, a cultural difference. Uh, you, uh, were, you, you saw that he dropped the rock and you were picking it up to give it to him, weren't you? And he kind of nudges over at QB like, 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 yeah, yeah all right. So, yeah. let's, so, uh, mm -hmm. yes, uh, as you see, uh, she will hand it back to you now. He nudges you again. Do we get a find this fee? to the other side of the room. <laughs> <laughs> Profec now like elbows Howie like what are you doing? Uh what is QB doing? And she throws it to the other side of the room. Oh my god. <sighs> okay, so he sees it tossed over, he looks over at the rest of you, he backs up and closes the door. Not interested in doing business with you again. Okay. Doesn't he want his thing? <laughs> Uh, you, well, I heard tossed to the other side of the room, meaning you tossed it in here, correct? Uh, just, like, away from him. Okay, where did you toss it? And I will go ahead and correct mm -hmm. it, what I said. <laughs> Ping, where um, you tossed it, please? Over here. I fucking knew it. <laughs> She's playing fetch. So, you, you, so, he, he, so I just want to make sure the scene is clear. He has asked you for the rock back, <laughs> and you toss it in the complete yes. opposite direction. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh, he will start to walk over to you, uh, over here, and yeah, slowly turn around, leans I down. I am so sorry about her. Picks it up, he gives you a dirty look, and says no other words, walks back in, and closes the door. The gambling hall will be shut off to you guys, unless reparations have been made. Damn. Well, we were so lovable, we could, we could turn him around. <laughs> um... Brulvec will look over at everyone as the guards sort of like calm at this point and uh, step back and Brulvec will lean down over to QB and the rest of you for anyone that will go ahead in here and will just say it's people here are um, very defensive of their possessions that shard especially was of, of high particular value you're fortunate nothing bad happened to you here. Please be a little bit more considerate, a little bit more careful. Don't steal from others so obviously. Yeah, QB, what the hell was that about? Uh, I don't know. I just thought it would be fun if we had it instead of him. Look, if you're gonna steal it, don't do it so obviously. Okay, sorry. And make sure he's in an alleyway by himself and then stab him and take it. Oh my god. Okay, well. Okay, I've, that's I've decided advice. this is probably the evilest party of all of. Uh... Tonto <laughs> looks horrified at this. So, yeah. does, so does all of QB. Yeah. QB, don't, don't listen to This her. is. I... Just FYI, this is, the, this is probably the evilest party of all the campaigns I'm running in phase three so far. QB, if you can. Yeah, I've steal, watched them and that's Pat wanna... and false. <laughs> What? Almost what do you certainly. mean? What do you mean? We're the wholesome Ghibli one, Brett. Okay. <laughs> we, well, we no, were the wholesome Ghibli one, then Brett killed my whole group. family. So Brett did this. Mm -hmm. True, true. I will, to so I will take the blame. I will take the blame. All right. So, uh, uh, so yeah, Brulvec will start kind of step aside. And, well, the rest of you can talk at this point while Brulvec is like, he's talking over at this guard trying to figure, calm things down that's happened here. Gooby, if you're gonna steal, try and keep it subtle. Like, you know, you don't want the other person that you're stealing from to see you, right? Oh, so I have to stab their eyes first? No, no, no wait, yeah. no, no. No, don't listen to her. Uh, no. Oh, okay. Gooby, I mean, Kobe, you're a bad influence on Gooby. What? I'm just trying to tell her how to survive. Well, that's it feels like surviving with extra steps. I don't see why you yeah, have Yeah, you're taking it like a step one too shit. far. No, I did say take him into an alleyway by himself. Yeah. And more oh. steps. Why do you got to kill more? him? Yeah, well, just when he's not looking, just swipe it off his back pocket, you know? Yeah. You know, I just want to point out that the source of all of my sorrow and hardships was someone stealing a ring. Oh. All right. I'm sorry. Maybe we you were, shouldn't steal so much. We've been very yeah. insensitive. Well, while that might be true, oh boy, <laughs> I just think that it's part of QB's entire MO. Maybe she grew up stealing. 
Look, you gotta do what you gotta do to get what you want, you know? I no, need no. to teach her to Hold be on. better. I had to steal if I wanted to eat. We are if teaching we her to be steal, better. Couldn't eat. How to not get Maybe caught. You don't have to do that anymore. Yeah, and you don't have to eat that gemstone. That's, that's true. Mm. So, only steal if I can stab them in an alley? This is, we're warping this child. I, <laughs> listen, QB, no I, I think the point is try to steal less and, Ooh. you know, only steal from very bad people. How do you know if it's bad people? Long Maybe neck. Maybe give it more than, t yeah. Oh, oh that's, that's dangerous. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's how <laughs> that Brett makes, makes a long sense. neck cool guy. <laughs> I, I don't know so about that. I feel like. Neck. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Look, we're, there are with the life of good that we're about to live. With the life that we're about to live, we won't need to steal anymore, so don't worry. Okay. Yeah. I think I understand. Suddenly, right. a goose man walks by you with a friendly yeah. <laughs> get it, get it. Hi, I'm a good paladin. Hi. Goose. Hi, hey, going? what's going on? <laughs> Hello there, friends. I've Kill been trapped here for quite man. some time. No, oh, sorry, I was just taking care of my kids. What's up? <laughs> They're dying, by the way. <laughs> and my grandkids, yeah. I'm a grandpa. I've successfully funded the the orphanage. We've been without money for so long. Oh Whoa, where's my wallet? She That's okay. Grandpa, she'd be conflicted. There'd be cognitive That's okay. Dissonance. They need it more. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. A, a giraffe man walks over. <laughs> hey, how's it going? <laughs> all right. All right. I, I guess, uh, QB, the point is, I think liberating goods from bad people is not necessarily morally bankrupt, but you must be sure of that beforehand. And you also must be sure that you're not endangering both yourself and everyone around you in doing so. Okay. I, I think I understand. I don't think she's retaining any of this, but I don't. I don't know. She, she's young. She'll learn. Yeah, the kids are <laughs> like sponges. <laughs> so, <laughs> Brolvek continues just like talking over this guard. He's like, it's, 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 it's their customs. It's just they're trying to figure things out. It, 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 that's how you exchange with things, you know. It's, it'll be fine. Everything will be fine. Brolbeck turns over to you all. Hmm, excuse me. And he says, ready for the tour? He is visibly sweating. <laughs> Why are you uh, so I sweaty? <laughs> I'm I'm not sweating. Everything's is it hot in here? I don't, little, I don't feel very hot. Are you guys hot? It's mm. a little warm. <laughs> Maybe it no? is a custom. Just it him? means respect to sweat. Maybe. Sure. Huh. It's a weird custom. Anyways, right Already this way. Down in my notebook. <laughs> inside check on him. Alan, don't sweat. <laughs> inside so. check on him. Inside, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, go ahead inside. Nine. Nine. Uh, yeah, nine. Yeah, the we're nine. not very insightful this whole party. We, yeah, we've the, always the new insight. empathy <laughs> insight. Yeah, the uh, the nine. Uh, he just looks sweat. I mean, you you can tell he's just he's nervous. Um, but as far as like trying to to tell like deception or oh, what's like actually set a going trap on, or something, yeah, you you unfortunately don't know. But it there the nerves are definitely getting to him. Also, keep in mind that he's walking around bruised and beaten uh, from <laughs> and uh, he has from a bomb on his neck, Rebo, and he has neck. he yeah. has a, a brand new piece of bling around his neck he did not have when he left there. So the guards yeah. are a little odd, and he's trying to keep everyone calm uh, at this. Uh, at this right. point, so he's like, it's fine, it's the custom. We got into a little bit. <laughs> All right, this way. Uh, I suppose we should head up over to the north quarter. I get yes. <clears throat> oh, you would you would enjoy this. Stay close, everybody. Uh, and then he'll uh, he'll sort of like turn over to uh, Remo, uh, giving another nod. He's like, I think you'll enjoy this. Blow off we a little bit of steam. We are not friends. <laughs> But we could be. Oh my god. 
<laughs> this way. Boop, boop, boop. This guy. Uh, yeah, this way. This way. As you're looking around, you actually see that these are like roofed houses within the palace of this area. They, the, 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 re, the, this is an open roof palace. So kind of think of it as like almost like a floating garden, but you know, no right. plants or fl flora or flana that can be seen of any kind. And uh, yeah, he's just gonna go ahead, continue walking around, and he says, uh, uh, "This right over here is the uh, living quarters. Uh, if you are, there are actually a couple of uh, locations here for our diplomats. Uh, if you're looking for a, a bit of shelter from the wastelands, I'm sure uh, my master would be more than willing to provide it to you." All right, this way. Where did the little Wait, rackling? Where's the furball? Yeah, where did the little rackling go? He looks around down the uh, down the hallway. You better not have collected him. He's following. He's he's uh, he's sad. Oh. <laughs> he's Bye. always sad. This is just a state of being. Oh, Jesus. The, uh, the group's as, a, the group as really has no desire to teach the child that stealing. You is try. <laughs> you do it. I don't want to be the parent. <laughs> you do it. Oh, I think I think we do have a desire. We ended it on, hey, you know, maybe dial it back. Uh, yeah. But you know, when you're dealing with someone that is potentially a psychopath, uh, I, you know, you gotta you gotta be tender. Kef leans down to Tantu and says, "It's okay. I'm sad too." Oh my god! Fucking hell! We are not friends. <laughs> He'll just nod and then keep going. <laughs> the brothers, in a sense. Um. Bond. So Brolvek yeah. continues uh, over uh, here. Brolvek, Brolvek. Mm, yes. Uh, you said the living quarters are here, and and uh, you house diplomats. Is that what we are? Is that the thing we're going with here? I mean, potentially. You are not natives here of the Shadow Vale, and if your yes. if if your natives from outside the Vale, I know my master would be more than interested to to uh, house you, would entertain you. Okay, well, I, you see that your wording is sort of vague because you could say the same thing about a collector gathering, you know, interesting creatures from outside the Shadow Vale. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, uh, that's where, uh, that brings up another thing. Uh, <laughs> he points over here. He looks over at the guard. The guard has this, like, horrified expression at the beaten uh, diplomat. And he just kind of shoes him away. He's like, It'll, it's fine. You don't understand the, the finer means of diplomacy. Yes, walk away. Walk away. Um, this right here is the jail. <laughs> he points over to this building. Oh. Just, just, oh. just unrelated, of course. Um, but we... Uh, Why are you leading us there? Oh, I, no, well, no. The, the, the entryway. We've already walked past the entryway. Is this a power play? It's is this, not. Are you trying to show us what you it's can do? It's working. No, listen. Well, we are we going to the jail? No, we're not going to the jail. We're, there's no reason to go to the jail, okay? This is scared I straight. Remember what I told this you. Is, this is, we're going to stop me from stealing. <laughs> he, he What's so, the Dr. Phil thing? We're going to send QB to the ranch? He looks over yeah. at Kobe <laughs> and, and says, uh, uh, I'm sorry? Jail is where people go before they're killed. I don't want to go to jail. Oh, did you react? Uh, 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 oh, he yeah. reacted. He said yes oh. over to Kofi. You cross us, you're dead. He leans over with the most widest, driest smile that he can give. He tugs at the collar and he says, I thank you for the reminder. You don't want to accidentally press a button on Artie, by the way. Just please don't do that. Yeah, watch where you're poking and prodding. He shakes a little bit. <laughs> the sweat has returned. I don't want to say that this guy builds like faulty gear, but no, I think no, he's blown it's, up a couple it's, times. It's actually, unrelated. If you touch the wrong button, he will change mode while wrapped around your neck. That You do not want that. His smile stays, but his eyes widen, and from a sort of annoyed but trying to be polite gesture has now turned into a frightened but trying to be polite gesture, as his eyes are just like, right then. Don't worry, don't worry. I've got the button here anyway to explode it. And he's going to drop the button, like, comically, and then grab it with his other hand. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> you'll be fine. Excuse me, Master Engineer, how many buttons are on this thing that could... Explode me, as you say. Artie has many features. Um, but no, only one button exploded, and that's the one in my hand. Uh, the, the button on Artie changes his form, 
and uh, while wrapped around your neck, there might be asphyxiating. Hmm. Uh, fascinating, I, I suppose. I know. Uh, I could go on, and I will. Um, anyway, <laughs> Artie. Oh my God. I could go on, but I will. And I will. <laughs> <laughs> so cool. uh, uh, no, he, he, he would just, like, peter off, like, talking to himself. I can go on. Here we go. <laughs> uh, uh, you will hear uh, from this over here in this direction. As he turns over, like just quietly and muffled, what is, appears to be a bunch of voices in unison. What's going on over there? Oh, uh, well, that is the, uh, that is the arena over there. The, uh, the, the arena of wrath. It seems that they're having a bit of a show right now. What would you like to see? Yes. <laughs> mm. <laughs> All right, then. Right this way, please. And he'll uh, walk over. Again, every time, every guard he walks by, everyone is just, like, looking off at him with this, like, yo, bro, you okay? And it's like, no, he's, uh... This he's, is rough, man. <laughs> yeah, he's... Should he's, have gotten him some healing or something. He nods, he nods. He's like, eh, it's fine, it's fine. Customs! That's all they need to hear. <laughs> yeah, really, just culture, blah, 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 customs, diplomacy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Culture. He's doing a lot of work. To be my over the board like carrying opinion it. is wow. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> our fighting should have been done at the gate when we stole. Like it should be over. <laughs> uh, as you guys walk in and hear everyone watching and cheering, you'll actually see uh, as two of these shadow-like tiefling faces off against a giant ink head, the flat head uh, for uh, for on on top of their head, and you're just kind of watching as they're all uh, attempting to fight this thing. This one. This individual has the high ground, is shooting arrows, and everyone is just loudly cheering and watching as the arena happens. Uh, this man over here spectating all the moves. As you'll see the dirt around, uh, various scorched, dissolved uh, moment, uh, places uh, to signify that some sort of element had been infused over there. And he Ooh. goes, uh, this is the arena where uh, Brave and and, and, and and powerful warriors uh, face off against the collector's more mm, vicious collection. <laughs> oh, this now this is this is nostalgic. Were you, I, is there were any you way a, I could like get in, in in and hop in this pit? Oh, were you a? Pit I haven't been in. Oh, I haven't been in one of these in years, but. I, possibly, uh, I could ask the master for you, but I'm pretty sure we're always looking for more entertainment, and you look like someone that could rouse up the crowds, yes? Oh, yeah, I'll give you a show. <laughs> look at this. He looks up at this we're still not man. friends. He's like, he's going to give you a show. <laughs> this this, this man guy. is looking past the, <laughs> past the herald, just trying to, to focus and watch on this. Uh, you will see... Um, as a little as a little thing over here, uh, you'll you'll see this line of acid spray just uh, come across, uh, finishing off uh, this man over here. As uh, yeah, and, he just, and then everyone just kind of gives out this uh, once it just you just hear the the cheer, the the howling <sighs> cheer as uh, another one bites the dust. I'm gonna uh, elbow this guy sitting on the bench. Uh, I'm glad I didn't bet on that guy, huh? <laughs> His response is, <laughs> like he laughs to himself oh, to I was you. waiting for him to say, I did. <laughs> oh no, no, no. He just laughs. He's <laughs> he's enjoying the uh, the conversation and the, the fight. Yeah, we're friends, aren't we? <laughs> uh, I like you. Mm. <laughs> Now it's starting to get awkward oh, and he looks past <laughs> you. <laughs> so, uh, okay. so the um, the Herald will turn around and says, uh, oh, we can go ahead and continue now if you'd like. Uh, right this way, please. And then he'll- I uh, think I'm gonna stay here. Are you just, uh, oh, I wouldn't advise that. You, well, I'm, uh, not good. I don't, I'm good, I don't wanna miss the end. Well, this is the best part. But you might be a part of that end. And also, if you are walking around on it, you know, unaccounted for, 
guards might think the wrong thing. Oh, I won't go anywhere. And I plop down next to this guy. <laughs> Put my can't arm around write, him. Can't this you guy... write him an ambassador's note or something? This guy <laughs> mutters under his <gasps> breath. Fuck. <laughs> like someone so oh. just kind of like goes over a little bit. He shimmies. Oh my god. Just a little Ugh. bit. Just a little bit. Just to get a little more space. You know yeah, what I Remo mean? Remo is like forest gumping this guy right now. And it's, yeah. it's, it's sad for him. Uh, the Herald looks around in a, a bit of a panic. Brulvec is just like, he doesn't know what to do. He doesn't know how to control these wild animals that have seemed to have wandered into the city. But more importantly, he does not want to be punished by the collector. So he goes, uh, 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 uh master, uh, I'm sorry, I don't think I got your name. I don't think he ever got Remo's name, right? Remo's just ignoring him and he just yells out into like the arena like, 10 credits on the, the archer. And uh, he's just, that's that's all he's got. I don't know, where does he pay? He, ra he raises his eyebrow and goes, credits? What you guys not? What do you, what do you guys not do that here? Mm. He, uh, t we pay in favors. Oh, I don't really have any of those on me. Mm. Kind of reaches in his pockets a bit. <laughs> Looking for favors. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, uh, I got uh, some jerky. Oh, uh, go go on. Uh, were you? Someone else was saying something. How? Uh, Remo. Yeah. I think they pay in souls here. That's Ooh, what the other guy. Spooky. <laughs> no, but not in a good way, Remo. I, I, I feel like they she might nods. be able to siphon your soul. Oh, that's no biggie. I, all right, I won't look. I won't put any money down. I'm, I'll just watch. So you're content staying here then? Yeah, yeah. No, I'll be fine. I'll just, I'll just watch. No gambling. All right. No. Have fun. Um. <laughs> Uh, he so Brolvik will kind of look over at this guard. He pulls him around, like he jerks him around, like turns him around 180, and he says, "That Lagomon over there is a respected guest to the collector. Please make sure that he is taken care of. I'll go ahead and show everyone else around." Can I insert uh, check that taken care of comment? <laughs> Kill him. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Take care Taking of him. Care of. Does hmm. a subtle neck slice. Hmm. I'd like to also make an inside check. Yeah, please. feel free. By taking care of, he means like make sure no harm comes to him. He's not. He's not trying to. He's not trying anything suspicious. How he um, eases on the hums. Yeah, but he, he, it, it genuine. It genuinely seems like Brolvik is like, if he dies within this area, I'm gonna get in trouble. So you don't right. fuck it up. Good. Good. Uh, 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 Master Lagamon, he waves his hand over. What? Uh, this is an unnamed guard that I have not learned his name. He's going to go ahead and just be with you, so to make sure no trouble arises. Not from your side, of course, just, you know, we're weird about strangers here. Uh, all right, fine, but stand like 20 feet over there. He gestures like back out to the hall. He goes, I'll I don't want you like standing near me. He's like, I'll stand right here. It'll be mm. fine. That's too close. You're scaring my friend away. He's <laughs> As he says, he gets up and he just leaves. He's oh, little, now look what you... Oh, he doesn't want to do with this anymore. Look it's, what you did. Whatever. You can sit there. Yeah, whatever. I need somebody to talk to. <laughs> he stares forward like a... Do like, you, like, you like the arena? He doesn't say anything. He just stares <sighs> on forward. All he right. leans back in his seat. A <laughs> prolex. Perhaps we should... Uh, Continue the rest of the tour. Uh, 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 sweats a little bit and walks over this in this direction. Uh, how he follows. What is everyone else doing? Don't get killed. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, he screams. Don't, uh, don't get killed. Uh, QB, what are you doing? Kiwi is contemplating, and she says to Tantu, Tantu? What? I'm, I'm kind of confused. I, I don't I want to pause just for a minute. Uh, Sam, you're picking up uh, audio from other players, just FYI. Just FYI. Okay. All right. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you may, uh, you may continue. Can, can you tell me 
Why, uh, why is it bad sometimes to, I, to take things and sometimes, you know, like Remo, he just, you know, beating guys up, but sometimes we say it's bad and I'm just kind of confused. Well, you, you have to consider how the other person's going to feel. Sometimes it's okay, but sometimes it, it might not be. How do you tell the difference? We just have to learn, I guess. Oh. Okay. I'll try to watch more. It's okay, I'll help you. Thank you. Come on! It's hard to know when people don't tell you what to do, you know? He grabs a hand and leads it off to the group. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. Awesome! As you guys are leaving, you just hear Remo go, Hey, so, uh, where do I get some soul? <laughs> to, like, oh god. my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. He'll be like, and he doesn't say answer. He just stares forward, just like, doesn't respond. Just right, of course. Just right. maintains his thing. Do I get some soul? Holy shit. Uh, all right, well, uh, this this way, please. Uh, don't mind everything. Uh, you'll watch as this one walks up and will just, in a very just snidely sort of voice, kind of bow over to the Herald and says, Oh, great and, and powerful Herald. What has happened to you? You appear to have suffered an, an injury. He'll, uh... I'm fine, thank you. Uh, <laughs> I'm uh, I'm doing well. It's uh, the customs of these uh, these new these outsiders that have come to visit our, our wonderful realm. Well, if you would allow me to, uh, let me ease your wounds. Uh, he looks at everyone almost as if to ask for as if he's asking for for permission. No, oh. he's fine. And just who are you to speak on concern. his back? What? The herald holds up his hand and he says, "It is, it is their custom. It's it's fine. I gave a a, a little bit of a scrap to them as well." <laughs> Where is your envoy of gods that surrounds you at? All types. Up, oh, change of employment. Nothing to worry about here. Anyways, I must continue on the tour. Thank you so much, my dear friend. Uh, he said he has a sweat as his nervousness continues. Kopi will wave and wink at this guy and start following. Hey, he looks over, just disgusted, and then continues back over, uh, speaking over with the siege devil. <sighs> You know, it is going to be quite suspicious if these wounds remain on me. I do need to get some bending done at some point. Just tell them you fell down to something. Well, it's rather suspicious when I have five to six strangers surrounding oh. me and I'm a bloody okay. mess. Okay. I can be one your them. guests. Oh, okay. As you keep saying to everyone. Well, that's what I have to say, so it doesn't look like I'm being taken hostage. Uh, what, what are you doing? You... Oh, continue? Sorry. I was asking, what is he doing? How he's like tinking him with a little hammer, like, uh, It's okay, I got you. What? Are you an automaton in nature? What? <laughs> no, get off me. He says, he like pushes you away as like you're beginning the one minute cast of mending, taking right on his arm. <laughs> he's like, what are you saying? Get, get off me. What? Huh. I'll cure wounds him. A little bit oh. of. Ah. Jesus, his has got a lot of HP. He does, yeah. yeah. His, his, you think he's uh, biological, Olive? His, um... Mm, yes. You'll see his bruises start to, to give away. His, uh, his, his wounds are, are, are slowly healing. He'll turn over to, uh, Olive. Someone he hasn't spoken to yet and goes, <laughs> Oh, well, well, thank you. Uh, miss? Inquiring for your name. 
The name's Olive Bow. But you can call me Olive. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Is she <laughs> points over at no. Olive who has fallen asleep? <laughs> No, uh, she she just that's just her her whole thing. She it's like a cultural thing. Uh, she's perfectly awake and ready to take cultural. you down. Oh, I uh, I see uh, uh, very well. Uh, yes. So down this area is the collector's dining hall, which I believe he is currently um, holding uh, a, 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 a a sort of uh, how you call it. Uh, what did he say? A luncheon. Uh, with some of the nobles in the area. Uh, if you would allow me to, I would like to go in there and instruct him on everything that has happened so far. And also to let him know that I have brought you here within the village where I'm sure he would be delighted to meet with you. But, and here's the thing, that I know one or two of you will object. <laughs> I have to go in alone since you have not been invited to dine with the collector. But I promise you, I'll be out right away. All you'll have to do is stay here in the alleyway. I check. don't know how I feel about this gang. Ooh, fuck, I'm dumb. Ooh. How insightful. He is nervous, uh, but he is not trying to be deceptive. He okay. is trying to explain it in a way so that everyone is fine, but mostly right. him. Okay. okay, well, we'll, we'll wait like here instead, and not in the alleyway specifically. Well, that's fine. You can wait out. He's like, he, as you're like looking over, like relief flushes over him. He's like, oh, that's that's fine. That's that's totally acceptable. Uh, you, you know, I will let these 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 fine guards know that these are my guests. He says out loud to everyone as they turn over, uh, over to Brolbeck. And Brulvec goes, and nothing is to happen to them. They are to stay here. Uh, they are free to rub around, but probably shouldn't because they might get in trouble. But yes, it's fine. Yes, that works, he says. He's just like relieved for a moment. He's like, yes, I can do that. I can absolutely do that. So, and he just moves oh, forward. He heads over to the, he's approaching the door. Howie steps I was going to stop him. him. Yeah, he looks over at Howie. Brolvec. Uh, yes, um... He... I'm sorry, what is your name? Howie. A pleasure to meet you, Lord Howie. Um, how are you going to introduce us if you don't know all our names, first of all? Well, I was just going to let him know that uh, outsiders from Aya... I mean, outsiders that we don't know of. Inside check, please. Mm. By me? By... Anyone that heard it heard that. Oh, that heard that, right? I Actually, see. no. You you could you could roll that insight. Okay. Actually, Howie will how we, we, roll that insight. Well, how we he's he's talking to Howie. Here? Well, he's talking yeah. to Howie. So yeah. Um. I, I thought you were saying he was inside checking me. I was no, like, oh. no. I'm sorry. He's yeah. I wanted you to do an insight. He slipped up. Oh. He's been saying that you guys are not from here, uh, but he specified that you're outsiders from Io. Oh, okay, yeah. Huh. I, mean, I and, thought and how you did notice that with the twelve. Uh, go on, Arx. In case there needs oh, to be a I was correction. Say, I, I thought I thought that was just like a a a Brett like slip up. I didn't know. Was oh no, that's him. that's him. That's him. That was him slipping up. So he uh, yeah. Continue, Howie. You just said that we're outsiders from Aya. He's gonna hold the button like really visible. Um. Oh, okay. All right. I, 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 I see what this looks like. And before you press that button, I would like to remind you we are outside the dining hall of one of the Lords of Shadow, a very powerful entity. And to have his herald glow up right in front of the dining hall would not be a good look for you. No, it it definitely wouldn't. But your life is still on the line. Just to be clear. Right, and that is where I must ask for another favor. Sure. He points at the neck. You might need to remove this. Why? Because if I walk into the dining hall with what looks to be a bomb strapped around my neck, there's going to be questions. 
questions. Marty doesn't that look like a bomb. Questions. He looks like an artillery turret. Well, it is still a piece of jewelry that is on me that was not once on me before. And I am not good at lying to my master. But you are good at lying to literally everybody else. What's different? I haven't lied to anyone. Uh, huh? If you can say that it is jewelry, because um, it is jewelry. Uh, QB, uh, this was a private conversation between him and, and Howie. Are you just walking up to, to enter the conversation? Oh. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> You're just like, I'm here now. She's like tugging on the back of his, of his trousers. Oh, where did you come from? <laughs> Fuck. I got bored. Right. Well, again, I am not one to lie to my master. And if there is a piece of jewelry on me that was not on me when I left, he will grow suspicious. You need to understand. Any jewelry? Can we not trade it in for something a little bit more subtle? He looks over at you. He says, listen, I'm trying to help you here. The collector is very interested in meeting you, not collecting you, because I know you're thinking that. Is very intrigued and interested in meeting you. We know that you guys have arrived from not here in the Vale, and we have suspicions of where and how you may have come from. So, that is why my master is interested in those that were in the valley to learn more of where you were from. Which this we all just sounds like collector babble. Like, how can you? So you know of us? You have suspicions of where we're from? How are we meant to take that anyway? But you want to collect us and say I us. know. I know general broad strokes. I don't know of you personally. I do know that someone has breached the veil, which I believe would be you and the rest of your lot, along with the others that we found within the valley. The Collector is very interested to learn more of what you came from. Now, if you are absolutely suspicious, we can take you outside the gate, and you can leave and wander around the wasteland that is the Shadow Vale. Or you can take a chance the choice is or, up to you. Third option. New piece of jewelry, but it's not visible. How about that? That's a compromise. He I'll looks, meet you in the middle. He looks around nervously. A, a Lord of Shadow is not dis easily deceived by objects invisible. Their sight is true. Right. And if I come I in with. I understand why. If I come hey, in you just, with... Go on. Oh, can't you just say that you know it's dangerous? Just tell the truth and say you're collecting it and you like it because it is dangerous. I have friends that connect, that's, collect that's dangerous That's ostensibly things. not the truth, Kibi. That Kibbe. is not the truth, my dear. He would be lying. I think that's the issue. Oh. We'll get to truth and lies, QB, in the next uh, lesson, I think. You, you need to spend more time with Tontu, that's for sure. Hmm. But he turns over to you, and he just stays there, and he says, I will not be entering there with this thing around my neck. If, hmm. if my master is suspicious that I have brought an object within them that can cause harm, my life is forfeit. Worse than anything that the lot of you can do to me. So if it means okay. death in this alleyway, or death by Lord Mephistopheles, well then I choose execution by your hand, and you should press the button right now. Okay, all right, all right. I hear you. One final idea. What <sighs> can you give us of value that would work as insurance? What do you mean? What's the most valuable thing you have on your person? I I can show you where the others are being held. The ones that were taken by the Brock in the valley. It's a sign of good faith to show you that they are okay. Uh Gosh, that is not what I was thinking about. 
Uh, I was thinking. Oh, were you looking for something of uh, something you, that's valuable to you? Oh, this is a bribe, he says to himself as he says. He just like taps his head and goes, "Okay, oh, I understand." It's just insurance. It, it's merely like I just, I just want to know that you know we could maybe no, no, run no, away no. something that you care about. You're speaking my language. This is this this is something that I can absolutely work with. Okay, well, shoot. I've been trying to hold off on these, but I suppose this will do. Um, don't magic bean me. I I know what this. I know I can read into this. Okay, what? and Cubie's magic beside me. Magic bean you? Is that what you said? Just an incident that happened back in Lundy a long time ago. No, 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 no magic bean. I'm gonna I'm gonna reach into my pocket and grab something. Hopefully that doesn't disturb you too much. That's okay. Right. I don't have a, a, a trigger finger. So the uh, individual that you were trying to rob from. Uh, that you attempted to steal the fragment. He looks over at QB. Um, these fragments are actually vital and very important. They're tokens of the collector themse him himself. Uh, he'll pull out what appears to be this round disc uh, of this obsidian. As you kind of just watch as this shadowy energy just surges, uh, you kind of see it glistens with the shadowy energy and he holds it up there. He states, this is a very limited currency uh, that is given by Master Mephistopheles. It allows you to exchange for something within his collection. And he has gathered a plethora of magical items. So, if you succeed in a favor for him, he rewards you with these shadowy fragments. And he kind of like holds up, he holds up this entire disc. The gambler that you spoke with had a fragment, but probably a fourth, I would say. This is the entirety of its whole, of its whole. And if you make good with the collector, you will be able to freely claim a piece of magical treasure. And I would And it means uh, it you. means a lot to you. Well, it does. It's a very limited currency. Uh, from my understanding, okay. you come from a place where currency is hmm, probably limited in some port, but feels <laughs> like it's limitless because everyone has it. Uh, I suppose so. I've never really cared much for currency as long as I can eat food and tinker. Mm, right. My point being that I just want something for leverage. Uh, I don't want to steal or rob from you. I, I will give it back if you are good for your word. If we oh. can't give you items of jewelry to assure our safety, we'll need some kind of down payment to, uh, to, to take care of that. He sighs and says, well, then uh, take this. And he holds out. These are Thank favors you. that I'm trying to save. To get to create to to get a a most valuable item from the collector, so that maybe one day I can. <laughs> I suppose the terminology is retire. Maybe into a palace of goal. my own. You, you want to retire? You want to be comfortable? Oh, I don't want. I uh, have much respect for Ma Master Mephistopheles, but. This is a majority of a lifelong pursuit. Once I'm old and decrepit, my words do my my words don't mean as much as they do. I would be trust me. I understand. I understand. I would be grateful to have a palace built in my name in the middle of this wasteland, something almost as glorious as this palace of the collector, but not ah. too glorious, because then I might get in a little bit of trouble. <laughs> Uh, yes, I understand. An ambitious man. So, this favor, he holds up the obsidian disc, means a lot to me. Because it's one step less, or one step more that I have to earn. So that I may well, one day retire. Yeah, it's your retirement plan, I suppose. And, and and that also I understand greatly. So I feel like we're getting along here. I, I understand where you're coming from. Um, however, I will take this and I will give it back. I promise you that. We didn't get off on a great footing, but nobody does when uh, as you when see blood coming death. out of his mouth and his eyes are yeah. just bruised over. Yeah, you have to understand. We were in a foreign plane, being assailed by a great many creatures we'd never seen before and were all hostile oh, well, we were on edge it is the uh the art of diplomacy it's not a beautiful thing as long as we see common ground 
Understood. Well, um, okay. He's going to lift up his hand and press the button. Ah! He screams and out loud. <laughs> like, don't worry. And everyone, you, worry. you guys from the north here just hip scream as if he's about <laughs> to fucking die. Huh? Uh, Artie just unclamps and falls off the back of his neck and, goes uh, and does his little beep boot routine. He falls to his he falls to his knees. He holds up the disc to you to hold on. Thank you. All right. Well, good luck and I hope you realize that while you are very helpful for us introducing us here, we can be very helpful for you. Um, nothing like a uh, entire party of powerful adventurers for an ambitious man like yourself. Y yes. Adventures. I suppose you would be an adventurer, wouldn't you? Well, I'm quite new to it. I was an artificer for many decades beforehand, but, you know, we're doing pretty well. Huh. I've heard stories of adventurers of Io. The Collector tells many of them over feast and dining. Hmm. Perhaps we can learn of your tale. Oh. Perhaps you can. For now, though. If you would allow me, he looks at everyone when he says this, if you could allow me a, just, a, just a little bit of time to explain everything that has happened to my master, I'm sure he would be more than, than welcome to, to host you here in the palace. And he kind of gives a, 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 a... Can bow. I ask one question before you go? Uh, he hesitates as the sweat returns. Uh, y <laughs> yes, little one. How can I the assist you? The man outside, they talked about trading souls. How how do you, you trade souls in this world? Oh, well, uh, many of the Shadow Tieflings have an ability to uh, tap, although it's easier when it's a willing participant, uh, into someone's uh, spiritual energy that is within them. Spiritual energy allows for the fueling of powerful magics, uh, the creation of, 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 of powerful uh, antiquities and artifacts. Souls are an, an especially potent energy source. And here in the Vale, we trade in spirits. We trade in favors, uh, like the one that I gave... Uh, uh, Master Howie over there. It's not your entire soul. Uh, you would you would cease to be who you are now, just a, a, a lifeless, restless, wandering across the wasteland. Uh, it's just a piece. But you would be amazed, even what the slightest piece, the power that it can hold. Uh, does that answer your question, miss? I think so. So the rock you gave to Mr. Howie, it's Part of somebody's soul? It is a bit more than that. Yes and no. It is a, the tiniest fragment of Mephistopheles' power that he has infused, he has branded upon this obsidian disc, signifying and showing that a favor has been given. And it cannot be so easily replicated. You, my friend, he looks over to Howie, are holding a tiny piece of Mephistopheles. I'm okay with that. <laughs> and then he looks back to QB. Uh, now with a smile, happy to be uh, educating as he crosses his fingers. As he, like, he folds his hands and crosses his fingers over. Does that answer your question, little one? Yes. Thank you. Thank you for asking. Knowledge is such a wonderful thing. <laughs> oh, oh mm, mm, right. If you don't mind me. And he will... Oh, I seem to have... Oops. Get around, gang. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he, oh. Oh, he <laughs> opens the door and he goes, My Lord Mephistopheles, I have returned. <laughs> the second he's in there, I would try and gather everyone around very quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just for a very brief, like, okay, guys, we do need an exit plan if if something goes wrong. Uh. I, I'm I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I, I have a confession to make. 
Artie is in full-on protection mode, okay? He, he could have done nothing to that guy except for maybe help him. So, you know, w w that was a bluff. Whoa, Mr. Howie, that was a very good bluff. I'm surprised nobody called me out on it, to be honest. I'm not known for being good at lying. Oh, we, we don't know what you can do with your little robot. Mm-hmm. Yeah? You think it's cool? Anyway, no, that's besides the point. All right, we need, we know where we came in from. We know how we can leave, but there's so many guards around here. We have no leverage on him right now, except for this powerful disc. <gasps> the piece of soul. You know what? I think it'll work out. We'll be fine. We can just run out the, the, the entrance. It'll be we easy. We should find where they're holding the nice lady from the village. Yes. Also, you maybe we that? should check up on her too. You mean the grandma? Mal? Oh, the grandma that I saw. We either go now, but that, that might be suspicious, or we bank on him being true to his word, and then we ask for him to take us there afterwards. Well, um, we did it. Oh. oh, no, you go ahead. I was going to say, we did an insight check, and Brett did uh, confirm that he wasn't trying to deceive us. Well, he, so, no, he was being, he was very nervous. Just, just so you are aware, I give answers based off of the role that you had. I will never give yeah. an absolute seal of approval. It's guaranteed. Yeah. We don't know that he wasn't trying to deceive well, us. Well, we, we do did know have that he was some high rolls on the inside. Um, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you, so if, just, if you have rolls, told us how he was. If you, I was gonna say, if you have faith in your insight roll, then uh, yeah, right, then you're good to go. I'm I'm personally above board of, of the mind that I want to maybe see this out because it yeah. like they they seem like they're loyal to this favor system and if it if it all goes tits up we might need to make a favor or do a big favor or something to get ourselves right. out of it. Okay. But yeah, I'm interested in finding that person as well. Okay, I, just I didn't, didn't mean think to it'd be good cut leverage. Off, uh, the conversation. Sorry. Go on. No, no, it's good. So we'll, can I we'll... see the thing? Yeah, of course. He hands it to Olive. She's gonna hold it in her hands. And look it's like at the it. size of your head. Yeah, she's gonna <laughs> squint at it. She's gonna sniff it. She's gonna bite it. As you bite it, is you it get real? a shock in your mouth. <laughs> oh. Does it hurt Mephist uh, Mephistopheles? Do we hear a yowch from the other room? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> That'd be great. Somebody's fighting Spartan Spartan my favors again. My <laughs> 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 No. Well, if you're gonna really leave, I'm I'm down with you know helping Tontu with the, the old lady. Right. Ah. right. Well, let's keep it I on. The, he did offer that. But... Right. <clears throat> okay. Well. Because uh, it's if, sad if... she's down here all by herself. Yeah, you think she shouldn't be around these demon folk? No, grandmas, you have to be careful with grandmas. Mmm. Mmm, I'm not gonna ask a follow-up question. <laughs> All right, well... I, GB I... lore, be careful with grandmas. <laughs> uh, <laughs> stop, no, stop looking no, at not that. like that. <laughs> like, you have to protect grandmas. Uh, Brett. Yes. Um, so, what I was going to do, uh, sorry if this is a little bit much. Um, no, no, no. It, it, this is what your, I was going uh, to do was, on you right now. I was going to give him, actually, Nelly, because I changed my infusion at the last long rest from the other thing that we had, uh, the, the bonus magic hit, because I already got that with the wand. Mm -hmm. Um, I changed that back to Nelly, the, the homunculus servant, mm. which is just like a little floating thin, um, goggle lens. Ah, uh, yes, I, I remember. Yeah. Um, and I think I don't, I can't, I don't think I can see through for, for Nelly, but I can deliver touch through them. Um, I was going to, like, put Fernelli under, like, slide it underneath the door or something, or let it flap underneath the door, because it can fly. And just see if it can have a little look. Okay, if so... There, if there's a gap underneath the door, I... That's imagining some there, wooden ass door. If it's just a stone slab, then yeah, it's it. There is this. There is no gap under the door, and it's totally sealed. It Can does. I like investigate? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you are free to investigate. 
No, I mean, I imagine it's sealed, if, if you said so. But yeah, okay. I well, guess there, well, I guess there, I'm just gonna. No, there is no gap under the door, is what I meant to say. Okay. All right. Um, I won't do that, but I'll I'll get Frenelli out and let them sort of like flap around me and look around. Okay. Oh, um, you know that you said that message. Or... Can you describe what these guys? I know we did like a little little thing oh, before, for, but I want to try what, and get some actual art. Yeah, for Nelly, yeah. Okay, Nelly isn't the goggles, so what happens is I have those artificer goggles on my head, right? Right. One of the lenses, because they have like several different lenses that all go in, get smaller. You know, like the classic gnomish goblin mm -hmm. engineering goggles. Um, one of the lenses is a trick lens that has, uh, it's just a regular ass glass lens uh -huh. with a little gold trim around the outside and then two little gold wings that it flaps around with. And the, outside, the gold wings sort of like fold in. And uh, little golden wings. Yeah. It is a tiny homunculus. Yeah. With okay. a Fresnel lens. Okay. Um, to, to yeah, that's homunculus team. 7. Which is another item that I can put on people and deliver touch spells through from 120 Holy feet away, shit. which is fun. Hoggy, woggy. Really yeah. Okay. Have you finished your discussion with each other before we advance on? As far as I'm aware, yeah. Yes. Okay. Claps his hands and he says, Good news, everyone. Lord Mephistopheles has invited you to dine with him and the rest of the nobles tonight. This is such an honor. And he's got this widest, the widest smile, like this is the best news he's heard all day. You're in! You're in! <laughs> You're in! Mm, is the food going to be better than this thing? She holds up the obelisk. What, what the? <laughs> it's not very good. You put it in your mouth. Was I not supposed to? It looks like a giant cookie. I don't think so. I've never you done it before. It oh, you should try it. It really gave me a shock. Oh, I Wait, think you I'll thought pet. it was food. Uh, usually that's what we do for currency if we want to check it's real. Where we're from. Oh. Oh, oh you didn't know? Okay. All right. Uh, yes, well, anyways, he holds I out his hand. I think I'm hungry. He blames like, everything on culture. <laughs> like motions. He this motions the obsidian the disc episode. back to him like, yeah. <laughs> all right, well, now that I've done that. Go on, Olive. Hand him the disc back. Oh, now, does Olive look like Frodo in Lord of the Rings right now? <laughs> Why can't I have it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I want the olive Frodo art to happen. Cast it into the fire, Olive. I think I deserve it. <laughs> okay, so I reluctantly hand it over. He pulls it out of your hand and puts it back into his pocket and goes, mm. Oh, sorry. I, uh, it's just a, a precious item. Um, also. Uh, because you are invited to dine, I've, I, I've made a couple of inquiries. Uh, your uh, Lagamon friend uh, and the rest of you, if you so desire, uh, can participate in the arena's activities. Uh, you have been given permission by Master Mephistopheles. And he has so kindly and graciously uh, given you uh, a place where you can rest for as long as you need to. Well, you are guests here within the palace. And if you'd like, I can show you to your quarters right now. Olive's what eyes go really wide and she's like nodding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This place has everything someone wants. And what is the cost? <laughs> mm -hmm. Is it merely curiosity to meet us and hear our stories over dinner? He is very curious to meet each and every one of you. Learn more uh, of your history, your past, share a story or two. It's all jovial. No cost at all. <laughs> Nothing like that. You well, are esteemed this. guests for us. There's no currency greater than curiosity. And he winks again towards the camera. What oh are you looking God. at? One final time. He stares uh, still. <laughs> no, don't worry about that. Um, 
He has this <laughs> thing where his eye goes small, one more than the other. <laughs> Don't worry, it's his condition. It's uh, to do with my age. He's anyway. just drawn that way. <laughs> what? Who did that, Bree? He looks around. Huh? So we're getting so meta right now. We, we went we went three levels of meta right there. Um, <laughs> all right. Well, that, I mean, I'm happy to tell our stories. I, I mean, I'm sure we all are. We have plenty. In fact, we don't know each other that well, so I'm happy to hear everybody else's stories. Oh, you don't? You mean you don't know me that well? He points over to himself. No, I mean we've only known each other for a couple of months. Wait, has That's it even been lie, months? Do you all are strangers? Mm -hmm. Not, yeah, uh -huh. it hasn't been that I long. I mean, pretty much. Hasn't uh, it been like it a like, week? Isn't in it been canon? like it's like One Piece hours, dude? Yeah, no. But you guys, clear, I, I, how, how I would was say, uh, yeah, this has probably been yeah, yeah. around like a month or so. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. But for old men, time moves weird. No, so no. How he's intentionally yeah. beginning it because he wanted oh. to, it to seem a little bit less. Like if it was a week. <laughs> It would feel like our relationship's tenuous, and maybe he would try and snipe in with a bribe to one of us to betray the other. You know, it could be dynamic. Oh my god. Howie's just a little bit further ahead in this conversation than the one that's falling asleep. I'm sorry. Right. Big cookie. <laughs> yes, well, there there are pastries that I'm sure that could be formed for, for the meal if you have any uh, special requests. Whoa. Master Mephistopheles has an uh, interesting recipes that he's acquired from the old world. Whoa. He looks over at uh, Kopi a little, uh, <laughs> like, flinchy. Do you have any hot springs? <laughs> Saw it coming. <laughs> <laughs> You, you know, there have been a couple of caves with pits of lava. And he looks Go back on. at you. Oh, that's it. Just lava pits. Oh, I see. Show me to the quarters immediately. Uh, 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 right away. And then he just like, his smile like kind of turns into a fearful frown as he walks over. And he says, oh, and then we can continue our tour along the way. Oh, wouldn't this be grand? Do, do you, I don't do you really want to care about the tour? <laughs> you know, oh, we're kind of I don't really behind. care about the tour. <laughs> All right, uh, then I will take you to the quarters right away. <laughs> I have to remember that I can't show stuff because Kopi wants to go to a thing right away. <laughs> <laughs> this way, I'm please. Sorry that but I'm no, that's okay. It. I, 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 as a DM, I have to get used to that. So, uh, he goes oh, right this way, please, and then he uh, will ask for everyone, and then we'll begin to uh, walk over. Uh, so, uh, Remo, you have just witnessed this ankhead down uh, both of these guards, uh, both of these warriors. Their bodies have been uh, scraped up, brutally and collected. Uh, and then the ink head returns to a small little opening over here. In a loud and, and boisterous voice, you'll see as the keeper uh, of the arena will, will shout, And that's an intermission until we find more capable warriors. <laughs> and then the crowd cheers. All right, and then you just hear Remo leaning over the guard and she goes, And then... She fed him a sugar cube. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. No, oh no. I'm gonna roll and see if this guard is terrified or if he is uh yeah. Oh, yeah, he yeah, he's looking forward like What kind of devil is this? He's concerned <laughs> of the story. Oh, I like you, man. You don't talk too much, but you're a great listener. Uh Master Lagamon, Brolvec shouts into the arena. What, are we done already? I'm waiting for the next show. <laughs> well, the intermissions do last quite a bit, especially with that one. Uh, maybe capable warriors can enter the arena. He winks and then kind of does a little shoulder nudge over to Kopi and then says, oh, sorry. You all right, what was that spasm? Wait, I didn't I didn't get it. Oh, wait, I'm... <laughs> I, that flew past me. I didn't get it. What? <laughs> yeah. Uh, he will look over to Remo and get kind of like, 
I like the idea of Kopi also not getting it, so that that's fine. That works for me. No, that was that was. I know that was. Alex I know that was the player. It. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll, oh. I'll, I'm about to explain it now. I don't want to be like, <laughs> what do you mean by that? <laughs> boop, 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 boop. <clears throat> uh, well, I've uh, spoken with the Lord of uh, uh, Master Mephistopheles. I've mentioned that uh, that you all were capable and fierce adventurers who have faced off against many dire threats. I'm not sure of your story, but I did hear the term adventurer once and twice, and, and you seemed very eager to be in the arena, and he mm -hmm. has given you and your friends permission, if you so desire, to enter the arena as combatants. Sweet. Is this the stairs right here? Uh, I mean, well, I mean, we I, I was going to show everyone the quarters first, um, and no. then, did you say oh or no? Oh, not no. I, I not don't know. Of no. <laughs> Just, no, no, I'm going in the pit. <laughs> yeah. uh, he'll, uh, he'll say, I, if you are uh, especially eager, you've been invited to dine tonight with Master Mephistopheles and the, and the rest mm. of the nobles. Um, yeah, but, I could eat first. Uh, but if you're eager before then, uh, I could always speak with the, uh, the, the Lord of the Pit and uh, see if I can enter you and whoever might be interested in a little bit of bloodshed. I could eat first. Oh, yes, of course. Uh, surely you'd be better to fight on a, on a full stomach. Uh, very well. Uh, allow me to show you to your quarters. And then he'll, uh, yes, please. Moving. Thank you. Start moving over here. And he, uh, he'll walk over. And as he walks, he walks over to the door. Uh, he kind of like holds out what appears to be a, a small and jagged rune stone that he holds the door. The rune, uh, you'll see a, a, a similar rune, like sort of ignite, light up on the wooden door, and then you'll hear a as the door itself unlocks and just he bows a bit and he says, uh, this building is for you. Uh, it has uh, a, a various, uh, it has various decor and, and, and decoration, if you will. One question. Yes. Does it have a fireplace? Um, well, I believe downstairs. Uh, oh, actually, right over here. He points over to what, what seems like a tiny uh, statue. Uh, it, the statue um, is holding onto like a stand. It has a small opening that you can ignite for a little bit of a uh, bit, little bit of fire. He looks over and he says, uh, it's not much since it does get a bit hot and, and humid here, but it provides oh, with a, a little bit of Oh, yes, of course. Uh, he's relieved that you are uh, happy about this. Uh, these four bedrooms are here. I know there's uh, many of you, so you might have to bunk up with each other. <laughs> uh, uh, I... Nope. This well... one's mine. <laughs> You're just like... <laughs> okay. Um, all right. So one moment. I need to give you guys access to this door because now you have access to this area. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, you're unlocking doors for us. <laughs> Dear diary. Oh, yeah. Today oh. I made a new friend. <laughs> I didn't get his name. I didn't catch it, but, but he had a great smile. But our friendship is beyond names. <laughs> okay. okay. Yes. Is that everything? Oh, yes, of course. Uh, if you'd like, I could show you where the toiletries are or any of the uh, No, just please leave. Oh, uh, yes, of course. Uh, he <laughs> just immediately cobbles away, closes the door. Close the door. Okay, guys. We have a way out. What? If things go south, we can use this. And I then... don't know if uh, opening a portal here is such a good idea. They won't know and they can't access it. I thought we were the only ones that can access it. What if one of them just like crawls into the fire, won't they? Out the other side. Do portals oh. even work here though? We're in a very, very different place. It's a fireplace. Of course it will work. Can I attempt to try it? <laughs> Where the hell's an hour? All right, let me go ahead and pull out the journal real quick and see what's happening here. Did you guys lose Kef? <laughs> I'm right here, he says. Uh, the wait, I lost. Of the mine. I lost Kef. He's, <laughs> he, no, he's been. He's like, I've been here the whole time. <laughs> what do you mean? I was he, just in the back of the group. He le yeah, he's leaning against the corner. He's just like, oh, I'm here. <laughs> So cool. <laughs> I love it when they materialize based on our perception of them. 
<laughs> because you were paying to have an ass. Yeah, if we now. just forgot about That's him, like he probably everyone would in real to life exist. Except for me. Yeah. Oh, yeah, protagonist like, syndrome. <laughs> Where no, is hard Kat? solipsism, but yeah, close enough. <laughs> I, I'm right here. Hello. Um, <laughs> oh, that's right. I was going to look at this. Okay. So, uh, oh, no. Allow me to pull out some documentation. Uh, okay. So, uh, you currently have 500 motes of creation. So, as you, like, go in uh, with the motes that have been granted to you, uh, these motes of creation are sort of, like, these glowy little energies uh, and as you reach over in your pocket to pull out the 50 necessary to light the portal uh, you will see that the, that uh, each of you have had the modes of creation uh, split amongst yourselves. Uh, the reason why this was split is because they are no longer uh, modes of energy they are tiny just onyx little pebbles now and you have, uh, and you have, uh, I have to do some math. Doo, doo, doo. Uh, you each have, uh, 83, uh, on, on you. So you kind of like reach out to get the boats and then you pull out like 50 of these little tiny, uh, uh, uh onyx rocks. Is this because I tried to attempt this that it happened, or they just were like this so to our you, surprise? So you, yeah, this is to your surprise because you're like, oh, we just got to go ahead and light the portal, and then you just get ready to pull out the, the moats, and then you're like, this is you, you feel something, you feel the solid pebbles instead of the energy uh, that you could normally pull out. Fuck. You can still um, attempt it. Well, I didn't Kobe mean. Will... Yeah, go on. Sorry. Copy will still attempt to try. <laughs> so you just like throw them <laughs> with the same ritual. Okay. Um, guys, I'm gonna take some time to do this. It, you said it takes an hour, right? It does. We take have some time hour. before. I really dinner, don't right? think we should open the portal here. It goes both ways, right? Yeah. But someone would have to know, Breck, what's our conception of, of what the portal like looks like or it feels like to interact with? Would, would uh, it be it obvious just, that you can do it? It just looks like a, a lit fire. Okay. Like it looks Does it like ever go, what happens if it goes out? Or is it magically lit forever? Uh, it's lit, but you have the ability to suppress the fire. But the mm. portal is still there. We don't get the... Uh, oh, the portal's still there with the fire suppressed. Do we not... Uh, are we able to sever the portal, I guess, is a question. Uh, that would that? be its own ritual, but yes. And we don't get, we don't know if we get the resources back for that. Uh, you do not know. You'll have to do some research okay. slash experimentation with that. Oh, uh, interesting. Okay. But that that could be something that you uh, can attempt in the future if you'd like. Mm. I I understand your trepidation, Remo, but it might be required. There's clearly not enough beds in this room. Well, not Wait, only that's that, your we... concern. Well, I mean, uh, I've been sleeping pretty rough recently, and my back is killing me. Look, I don't care that much. I can take the floor. Okay, well, you were the first one to walk in a room and claim it, but... Well, yeah, okay. but I, I'd like to sleep in a bed, but I don't have to. Okay, okay, you know what? I won't sleep in a bed tonight. Happy? Yeah, sure. I'll take two. Two beds? No. Yeah, spread my wings. What are you going to do? Drag him into the other room? Hi, Kef uh, here. You might have uh, to do that for me. <laughs> Kef here. You're taking I'm, the floor. I don't I'm okay with the you. quarter. Yeah, I'm okay yeah, with no, that. Sleep the floor. on the desk. You're lucky I don't to exist. Take up much room. <laughs> he looks down in shock that you said Whoa. that. He's <laughs> like, I guess we're all lucky we exist. <laughs> Kef existential breakdown speed run. Yeah. <laughs> it's such a break. Yeah, exactly. Holy shit. Kef, you're an NPC in a video game. <laughs> What's oh the name God. of the... What's the name of the dust thing again? I forgot the name. Uh, it is Moth. Moth, okay. And besides, we might need some help from Moth. Who knows? Moth might be able to help us in this realm. How? I don't know. It can do a bunch of magic. Yeah, only in its realm. Whenever he hops out, he goes, ooh, I don't like it out here. I kind of miss Moth, though, and I think it might be a fun idea. How do you feel, Tontu? Uh, and where the fuck is Olive? I think she's asleep. Oh, yeah, I think I hear that. 
All right, so votes for opening the portal. Uh, I'm I'm happy to do that. Um, can we close it again if it's a bad idea? I don't know. Maybe we should ask Moth. If we can't <laughs> close it, it might be bad, but I like it more than us all dying here. I, I what, agree. What, what, what? We're not dying have here. We have, a, we have lovely accommodations. I'm going to go fight in the arena. You know, it's going to be great. What, what was that, Tonto? I said I, I think it's a good idea to have a way to get away. I don't like yeah. this place. Okay. All right. That's two. Uh... I know Kopi's for the motion, so I feel like that's a majority, considering Olive's asleep. And Kef presumably doesn't count, looks at Remo. <laughs> Kef's like, I'm still here. <laughs> I am a per- I'm a person. I have, I have value, okay. <laughs> mm, will we lose vote. a lot of things if it doesn't work? Because I'm for it, but I, I have a feeling it's not going to work. Well, it's worth a shot. And she starts working on the ritual all right the pebbles are spent and you begin working on the ritual for the hour what is everyone from else my doing? own pouch of yes. the split Correct. amount yeah that's the only way you'd be able to do it unless you like <laughs> robbed everyone <laughs> you would do like give me that give me yours be like look give me your there's share. a cow behind you <laughs> <laughs> it would work too yeah yeah uh, during the hour, what is everyone else doing? Uh, Sleeping. <laughs> You're tinkering in my room. <laughs> yeah, quietly tinkers. Actually, doesn't need to be quiet. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Remo's gonna start doing some like exercises in one of these side rooms to get warmed yeah. up for the fight. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Nancy, what are you doing? Sleeping. You're sleeping on the on the hallway. Is it oh. possible? Oh, I'm gonna sleep in the bed. Okay. <laughs> yes, Kobe. Is it possible to also use Zero the Bold to uh, empower uh, this at all? You could make a religion check if you would like. Okay. Oh, wrong mouse. Uh, as you try to channel Zero the Bold, uh, her uh, energies uh, would not be able to assist you in this in this task. Okay. From the check that you rolled. <clears throat> All right, everyone's resting. Before Tantu falls asleep, yes, please. or as he's falling asleep, he wants to ask his new shadowy friend for help, as he's very feeling very uh, anxious and unfamiliar about this situation they find themselves in okay um and i think in the vision or the dream he has Mm -hmm. it would be the shadowy figure giving him a piece of himself he like breaks off like this this clump of shadow and then this is going to be my my law way of doing fine familiar Mm. uh so when i wake up hopefully uh, uh, fine steed, sorry. When I wake up, I'll have a little shadowy steed. Okay. I, uh... I mean, that's hella cool. Hell yeah. So, the way we'll, we'll, we'll do this, just for, like, how your ability works, is you, you have sent a call out to the steed. Uh, so, when you awake, there won't just be, like, a horse just waiting for you, uh, ne- next to you, uh, in your room. Um, but you have, this is all right with you, of course, like from a lore standpoint, uh, you have, ma- you have made the call and now this, now the steed must find you. It'll find you, uh, pretty quickly. I will say from a game mechanic standpoint. Okay. Sounds yeah. with you. So, yeah. He has a dream that he's, he's given a little shadowy gift and then he wakes up and nothing changed. Okay. I guess that's what he's dreaming about. Yeah, he's just he's just kind of asking the figure for help. Okay. Because he's he's un- he's uncertain. Not not even just about the situation, but his party too. Maybe they're not the good people he thought they were. He doesn't know. Oh, they're not. No, yeah. The horse is here. Never claimed to be. 
Uh, one moment. I'm making a note of some more. Speaking things. on morality, though, while you make a note. Please. Um, yeah, I'd, I, so far, I mean, Howie's definitely utilitarian. He will do anything to it, like, make something more efficient. Well, sorry, not anything. But he does have morals, right? Like, he's not going to go... go raise an entire town of people to get something done easier but it seems like we do have a broad spectrum of of moralities or align yeah. uh, alignments you. All uh, good can't you have kill. Everything. also yeah. <laughs> uh also tantu um in the future when you speak with your shadow entity uh, we may go into an alternate scene for that. Just FYI, just so you're, just so you're uh, aware. Yeah, that's as cool. A, I just a, didn't want to like slow down the. Oh no, the no, you're good, you're good. I'm just, I'm just giving you the heads up because we haven't done that so far. We've kind of just been like, you did this and we moved on. I'm just letting you know that <laughs> if yeah, we shift over to a new scene, it. yeah, 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 cool. Okay. The ritual is complete. You'll see a small flicker of a flame sort of light uh, within this area. Oh my god, this is so disoriented. However, the flame isn't that gentle orange, yellow, and, and, and red light that you're used to when it comes to uh, a kind of flame. You just sort of see this. Let me see here. There we go. It kind of lets off this strange, sort of purpley, bluish mist. But even the fire itself sparks unnaturally. And then you um, will see. Oh, yep, go on, oh. please. No, please no, no. no. I'm, you please listen, please. Er, er, excuse, <laughs> no, I didn't mean to say it. Please continue. No, no, no. Please continue. Say. Please continue. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We're just, we're just, Alex and I are just out sorry in each other. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Here we go. Please continue. Fuck. I, I will be continuing. Uh, sort of, sort of transparent, not in full form. Uh, you will see moth form <gasps> out of the flame and look around. Oh, shit. A little it bit. worked. And he looks over to you and he just goes, and his voice, even, even Moth's voice is distorted huh? before stating, Toby, is that you? Yes, Moth. I can, uh, is I something can, wrong? I can barely see you. Where, where are you? Are you still in, in Frostfell? No, we're not. That's the problem. Uh, but, but, uh, the, the keep was connected to Frostfell. You never returned back to the keep. The Wait, door, uh, the door collapsed. It shut in. What is this? Go on. What is this place called again? This is the Shadow Vale. The Shadow Vale. Okay. <laughs> We're stuck in the Shadow Vale. What? I, I'm sorry. You're breaking up. Did you? Did you see the Shadow Vale? Yes. A silence, yes. a silence falls over Moth. You, you're contacting me from the Shadow Vale? Yes, that is correct. Uh, I, I, I. And then Moth ends the call. He hung up. Did he fucking hang up on me, that little twat? <laughs> Moth! Moth! Go ahead and roll an intimidation check. Oh, there it is, baby. Let's go. A small spark of moth appears. Just, just very, this time very transparent, sort of hiding within the hole. Moth! That was a little rude of you to do. Shh. Be quiet. What? They're looking for me. What do you mean they are looking for you? Explain yourself. I, I don't know. 
All I know is what I've been taught. That... That figures from the shadow. They want me. They want the keep. They've been looking for us for a very, very long time. You're not the collector. I don't know who that is. All I know is, if you're in the shadow, Bale, you're in great danger, and you need to get home right away. Well, that's why we called upon you, so we can get out of here. Oh. I mean, this is... This isn't... This isn't like what was connected. This wasn't like Frostfell. I mean, the door that was the Shadow Veil before. The door that the Count had opened. I sealed it up. I dispelled it. I destroyed it. You can't have entities of Shadow. Wonder. In the Keep. There's gotta be a way to bring you home. But more importantly, not bring attention to the shadow. Once upon a time. This must have been so long ago. I... I'm uncertain if this is from a dream or a distant memory. But the keep was able to go to the Shadow Vale. It housed adventurers like yourself. We were able to go to the Vale. We were able to return. Maybe we can do the same for you and your friends. Or you can try and find another way out. But either way, either option is bad. You'll have to find a breach or we can try to go to you. But if the shadow claims the keep, then we're all in trouble. And myself, and the keep would probably be destroyed. What do you want me to do? Is everyone asleep, Bowie? <laughs> I think so. You're the only one that's been talking. Everyone else I'm is tinkering, but I can't like, you're like whispering in the other room. Yeah. Can't yeah, hear. basically I'm not interested in what's going on. Um, well, I mean, Kopi is not too much of a thinker, which is why she's going to call out to um, everyone. If, I mean, they. Do okay, you just scream out, just... like, everyone wake up? Uh, hey, everyone, get over here right now. As you raise your voice, you just kind of watch this moth, like, covers his ears a little oh. bit. Moth! Uh. Kopi, it worked? Not quite. I, I... It seems that there's a kind of a severed connection almost as interference interference yes it's... i wasn't very good at english <laughs> or yes common common the veils that connected to the keep they're established links although i'm uncertain of what frostfell may have been but you're in a veil that was never meant to be connected by the keep which is why this does not work the way that it did before in Frostfell. We could use this as a as a way of communicating. But the longer that I stay in here, the more I'm in danger. Is there anything you can do on your end to help us get out of here when we need to? If you command it, I can find a way to bring the keep to the Shadow Vale. But by Wait, doing that's so, not useful. But by doing so, well, if we if we deliver the keep to the veil, we might be able to escape from it as well. Return back to Io. But the shadow wishes to claim the keep. I 
don't remember. So if I do that, there's a chance that entities the Shadow Veil will claim the keep for themselves. But if you're in the Veil, there may be ways, breaches that you can find to escape. That would require a bit more investigating on your part. There's nothing he can do. No, right. he just said what he can do. If no, we find I, a breach, he can bring the keep and we can escape through the breach, I, I imagine. As in, if I bring the keep, well, it won't require a breach. Keep yeah, it's like you yeah, weren't even that's listening. That's understood. That's, yeah. but he, he wait, just told, wait, he just told us that he can't. No, all good. Above, above board, I'll give you, I'll, I'll give you the two options in case I'm not explaining it clearly. The, no, you're pretty clear. Well, I, I understand. <laughs> oh, no, you're good. You're good. I'll, I'll, I'll still explain it above board just so we're all on the same page. Um, So Moth said that he is saying he can ship, he can try to look into shifting the keep into the Shadow Veil. You guys go into the keep and he can attempt to shift back to Io. The problem is he believes that the keep would be in an absolute threat in the Shadow Veil. Whatever connection he yeah. has to the Shadow Veil, he does not remember. And he... But he fears the veil. He fears the shadow veil. He he fears what may happen to him in the keep if they try to go. Or, this is the or, the other option. You can try to find a way out on your own. Uh, there through a is, breach. yeah, there, through through right, a breach. I took it as the breach would aid us getting out in the. Oh keep, yeah, no, it, they, they're they're two separate uh, things. Well, the right. first option is definitely out of the question for moth. Is that that's what I was trying to yeah. Like get it. that's why i was like moth so you can't is, help us moth is reluctant but as but you say he can't help you can't help but when you he say said you, you can't can help order us, him to do it he's like yeah. I, so he doesn't want to but technically you are custodians of the keep if i don't like that i don't like that word if you command me to do so i i will do it i am to serve you and right I'm, i am reluctant about it and I wanted to share that with you. Huh? If, oh. if the keep is here, how how can we go back to Io with the keep? Is it magic? I don't understand it much myself. But this keep has great powers. Not only can it connect to worlds, it can it can it can teleport to them. It can shift to them if necessary. I don't understand it myself, but I do think it could be used as a vehicle. But again, it puts great risk to me. It put great. It puts great risk to the keep. But I'm afraid, at the risk of sounding rude, we'll have to decide the plan now, because the longer that I am here, the greater at risk I am. I think we should defer to your judgment, Moth. I, I, I think we should find a breach. Yeah, you can hang up the call. I, I don't want to say I told you so, but we never should have lit this fire. No, it's fine. It, it, we wouldn't have known any of this if, had we not done that. Yeah, but they might know now. Uh, glances Do you know back if they know, the Moth? So, <laughs> above board, as a party, this is kind of a branching point of how to escape the shadow yeah do you order moth to bring the keep or Breach. do you try to find your own your own way out i'm for the latter yeah vote we find a breach yeah latter vote i, I guess i want to explore more of this realm too mm -hmm. above board i want to try and risk it and find good shit there's an arena i mean like I mean, I don't give a fuck about that, but that's like great, anything, man. actually, actually good, yeah. Actually good, yeah. <laughs> I guess we're stuck finding a breach. Thank you, Moth. We can still communicate with each other. Then I hang to, up on him. We have to do it in small pockets. How did you create this? Do you still have access to the modes of creation? Well, not quite. They, they've turned to these weird pebbles, but obviously it seemed to have worked because we're talking with you at least. Yeah. Well, it doesn't create a portal, thankfully. 
It seems those moats have been tainted with shadow energy. If you wish to communicate with me to, to form a plan, or maybe I can f offer some sort of assistance, all you simply must do is cast one of those into the fire. There you can give me a brief message, and I can reply as w with uh, the same, with another brief message. But you would only be able to do that once per day. Above board? You can send a message to Moth across the veils. You have Text to spend. Message. Yep. Nice. You have. You have to spend. Uh, t you can only say uh, twenty-five words, and then he could sure. respond back to you with twenty-five words. But you can only do that once per uh, once per long rest. That's fine. Okay. Okay. We could do little drops, drop-ins. Okay. We'll we'll report back to you, Moth. Thank you. Now get out of here. He'll. Uh, <laughs> I'm tell him twice as he'll. Be safe, Moth. As he blinks away. I don't the, trust him. As he blinks away, the fire will also <laughs> snuff out. I thought you loved him. He has some kind of connection to the Shadow Realm. He uh, he spoke on memories or dreams, but regardless, I don't know. Uh, he's a devil, a demon of some kind, and he probably, I don't, maybe he originated here and was taken by by the uh the curator or maybe even the the, the long since ancestor of the curator the creator of the keep Howie, what the fuck are you talking about i'm it's just not some crackpot theory this is real stuff okay mm -hmm. well because of that i thought he would be able to help but ah uh, we must find a breach that's what it comes down to at least we know there's one Somewhere. I feel like I'm taking crazy pills. I'm sorry, wait. <laughs> he is connected to the Shadow Realm, yes? We all heard that. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. And 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 we, are we distrustful of Ooh. beings of the Shadow Realm? Yes no. or no? Why? No. Maybe. Well, not completely. Sometimes. Why should we be? I don't know anything about the Shadow Realm. That guard I met was pretty cool, actually. I think yeah. you're right, Howie. We it just we don't know anything about them. It's very I know. different. Right. I, I'm not making any judgment calls. I'm clearly in a functional relationship with Moth, but I'm reluctant to put my whole trust into him. Oh, I like the little guy. He's cute. Yeah, but so some people would say the same about QB. I think I think he's good. Mm, that's a good point. What? Don't worry, Kibi. Well, it was worth a shot. Go back to sleep, I guess. No, it was a great idea, Kopi. I just, I feel like we, um, we're playing with powers beyond people that ventured forth from Lundy only a month ago. Oh shit, I gotta pay my rent. Right? I'm probably know. hunting you down by now. Oh, at least somebody's looking. Oh, wait, what? That was kind of sad. Wow. <laughs> Everyone looks down, Sag. Yeah. All right, well, breach it is. Mm -hmm. Well, what should we do then about the dinner and the th and stuff? Oh, I don't know if we should eat that. Well, we're waiting to be called on, aren't we, Tonto? A knock at your door. Shit. Yo, doorman, you gotta get that. Oh my. I'm not the do- <laughs> He doesn't even try anymore. Don't He's... support this. Don't support this. It's not okay. <sighs> Tonto will get the door. No, no, no. I've got Do -do. it. And there he is. There he is. You'll watch as um, a fully healed Brolvec will give another deep bow. <laughs> Kev, like, bounces back a little bit. My uh, esteemed guests, uh, dinner is served. If you wish to follow me. Oh boy, let's Wonderful. go. Yeah, I'm starving. You sound right. like you have something in your mouth already, Remo. 
I'm scarfing down some jerky. All right, but like, really, though, we're not, we can't eat any of that. It could be poison. Why not? No, we can eat some of the food. I, I actually have Wait, a, a spell on. I can cast on food to purify it. Oh, I was about to ask about that. Like, to have any of us, like, check to see if there's anything wrong with it. All right, if you say well, so. We'll check about the table, but yeah. Wait, what if we're dinner? Uh-oh. Oh, sorry. Let me, uh, re let me, repeat, what, let me repeat the scene with Rolvek. Dinner is served. <laughs> it's us. It's us. <laughs> and he points at you and he just licks his lips. <laughs> he points at you and he's like, That's trustworthy. This is fine. It's been a Real while crazy. since we've had Lagabon for dinner. <laughs> oh no. my gosh. That, that makes happened. sense. No. No, that Real quick, did they, did everyone at least take a short rest? Uh, yes, everyone would have been a short rested. I don't think we've done anything. But also, yeah, no one's really done has spent any yeah. uh, resources. Well, okay. you've got a little bit less HP, Kopi. What what is that? Why is that? I think Kopi got punched in the face by punched a guard. Punched in the face. <laughs> right. But again, right. yeah, negligible. Wait, something something like that, that maybe. Yeah. yeah. You took a blow from somewhere. You took yeah. I think you took like one singular hit from the two guards, and then you went. <laughs> No, no, no. And then he stabbed him. Yeah, because I didn't use any key chasing this guy down and that's, beating him up. That's how I remember it, at least. Yeah. Uh, if you would like, I can uh, guide you. Yeah, just get there. us there, man. <laughs> Nobody's coming. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, Brett. You're welcome. Thank you. I'm we, moving, I'm it's moving fun. everyone. Oh, boy. I, don't know. I tried to take a rest, but I don't know if I did it right. Uh, all you have to do is inform me that you're taking a short rest, and then I'll be happy to do it for you. Oh, like okay, thank you. Also, I think you did do it. Well, you took a long rest. Now, long, just so you're aware, L rest, long rest is uh, eight hour rests. This would have been a yeah. short rest. So, um, is short rest forty five or one hour? One hour. Okay. So if you are un unsure whether you're taking a long rest or a short rest, I will happily do it for you. Thank you. Okay. So, Brett, I can't get over how much these guards look like Chris Kirsten Stewart from Twilight fame. Mm. It's well, like been vexing me this entire session. I mean, you know, if there's one thing I from love about Twilight my NPC fame. tokens is that they yeah. look like DBZ characters and Kristen Stewart from Twilight fame. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it is great there. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. I'm making sure I'm not forgetting. Oh, I think I am forgetting someone. It's probably Kev. And it is Kev. And I'm here. No. <laughs> he's the protagonist. No, he's yes. the dinner. No, we're the oh. side story character. Oh, okay. <clears throat> My esteemed and humble guests, allow me to introduce to you one of the eight Lord of Shadows. Lord <laughs> Mephistopheles. And you will see this elegant devil Ooh. sitting at the end of a table. And he stands up along with the other nobles. And they give you a respectful bow. Is he actually that big? Yes. Go. Oh, oh, wow. Damn. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, he's about, he's about uh, I'd say, 12 feet tall. Holy crap. <laughs> Howie how Bowies. A little intimidating. Howie Bowies. <laughs> Howie Bowies. <laughs> He's so polite. And you will arrive in uh, as Lord Mephistopheles smiles and will state Greetings, my like uh, Greetings, my esteemed guests. It has been a long time since I have catered from those of my home of the Prime Plane. I am curious to see how your world has been faring since a thousand years ago. I hope that this meal will not only fill your stomachs, but fill, your, fill our minds as well. Please, let us sit down and eat. And that is where we will stop today's session of Curious Curios. Oh, oh. Yeah.
I was three seconds away from calling him duplicitous. I was mm -hmm. four seconds away from punching him in the face. I was five seconds away from saying big man, bigger cookies. <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> All great things that I will make note of for next session. Yes. Yeah. The next as, five seconds of the as, end, like, next session could be crazy. As, uh, <laughs> as, I'm, as with all the things that you have said, I'm excited to announce that next session will be the finale of Curious <laughs> Curious. <laughs> oh, you yeah. oh. no, I'm kidding. No, I'm not. I'm not. <sighs> well... If you punch a Lord of Shadow yeah, in the face, it, it, it will not end well for you. Is the best. Bro, we're way level five now. Okay? No, we're level <laughs> five now. That's basically yeah. like twenty. Oh, we're basically like that. max. Yeah. Uh, if, um, uh, a uh, a shadow, a Lord of Shadow within the Shadow Veil. The minimum challenge rating is twenty. Just FYI. Oh just, my! I don't know. And what also, that means. look at those fingernails. Like, oh, what? And, oh, what that means is uh, a suited for a party of level twenty adventurers. Mm, yeah. I did the math. We got about that much combined. <laughs> I added to five That's together. Not how that <laughs> yeah. I added to five together. We're gonna get six fives. That's uh, a bigger number. Yeah. <laughs> did you guys have fun today? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I enjoyed a lot of the character interactions. It was yeah, I did. Character, I like, did too. Interaction. That was good. I'm glad we had some some role play moments. <laughs> You're in danger. Right, Lords of Shadow have over oh, yeah. a thousand HP. Oh yeah. Well, I can do like twenty damage. In, oh like, yeah, one but hit. I could, I could like one run. Turn. I could like run real. I could fast. like leave the Shadow Keep yeah. and like never come back. I could, I could, I could, I could leave. I could just run. I away could really actually quick. get. I think entirely out of this building in one turn. The Lords of Shadows were actually we the, the front door, mate. They were the the final bosses in Phase Two. So, yes, they were, and they were assholes. Mm -hmm. they Maybe they've grown softer as of late. One thousand years in the future. My bad, my bad, my bad. Guess we'll find out next time. <laughs> I think we're good for next week. Yeah. Yes. I think we're 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 gonna be doing next Tuesday and then the following Tuesday. So eighth and fifteenth, we've got scheduled the sessions, and then oh, the, um yes, I'll I'll tell you in DMs, I guess. I mean, if we can't do it, uh, just just so you're you guys are aware, I'm taking off Thanksgiving week. Like, I don't care. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Thank yeah, you. I, I well, appreciate that. Makes sense. That. Yeah. Yeah, I'm I'm taking I'm taking off, and then if we're if someone's taking off the 15th or the 8th, I'm I'm not changing that week because that's gonna be me time. Yeah. Oh so, yeah, okay. that's big food time. Yeah. Oh, so, hell yeah. but um, yeah, you could tell me DMs. I think we're um, Arix, just FYI, if you have to like step away, if you can't make it for a session, I think we're at the at a point story wise. Well, it depends on what's happening once we get to that point. Are you are you saying 15th's a no go for you? Yeah. Okay. Then the fifteenth, and it depends on what happens uh, on the eighth. Um, but more than likely, what'll happen is we'll take the fifteenth off and the twenty second off. So because I'm, I'm not. Yeah. I'm yeah. not, I'm not gonna. Fun. I'm not Big gonna. Christmas. Much. It's yeah. fine. It's like holiday time. So yeah. 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 I need a week off. So that that is absolutely happening. So if we take yeah. two weeks off, we take two weeks off. Um, um well yeah. I, I have to get back to you. That's that's the Arix, thing. if you that's have something Arix, something just killing do. me. Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay. I just I, I, I didn't want to make a no, big just, deal about just it. Just roll a Commit. d20. Roll a d20, Alex. <laughs> yeah, roll a d20. Arix, I've decided we're gonna play D and D and you're gonna be there. Okay, no, okay. All right, I'm done with this bit. I'm done with this bit. Um let us do the thing. Uh, bingo time. Bingo, bingo, bingo. Just kidding. I clicked the wrong thing. And then I'm going to share it. Actually, I'm going to share it right Why now. is there like... Yes. There's like five ton tontus on that table. You see hey that? Yo. Uh -huh. Are you talking about the also, chickens? Oh, yeah. But also, look at the ribs. Like, look at the fucking scale of things here. There's, there's yeah. giant things. There's small things. There's giant everything. cookies. Chicken bodies. Like oh, I said. I don't, I don't get it. Giant uh, cookies. Is that the part in Central Chibito where they're the like meme. eating Listen, all those meats? A a a yeah. a anything <laughs> that is said, I just assume is something I'm not in the know of. And I, go, I assume uh -huh. it's a TikTok and I'm not along. <laughs> I'm Wait. assuming. 
it's a TikTok. Wait, what? Giant cookie? You yeah. said big man, bigger cookie, or whatever you said. No, that's just Olive's logic because she tried to eat the fucking disc oh, earlier. That, that was an original. Yeah. Brie, we, I, Brie, I can never know. Brie, we live in a world of dude. Get with it. Brie, we live in a world of memes and TikTok, so it's. Very... I know my stream told me the other day I referenced so many memes that they don't understand, and I have yeah. wanted to explode. Oh, on that the is, spot. I think it was wicked. It gets but... bad when you like when younger people don't know the kind of memes you're referring to because they're know. 15 years old, and you're like, okay. oh, I'm old. It, it gets bad when you're like having a conversation and you think like everyone's on board, and they're like, yeah, I'll be honest with you these past couple of years we never know what you're talking about no idea what the fuck you're saying oh no no. okay (laughs) well i'm glad my life's a lie anyways you want to do some bingo (laughs) yeah Yeah, show that we're really old yeah yeah all right let's get to it uh the count let's do uh curious curious curio season three episode two the collector's call hold on i'm making sure we're good yep we're good okay awesome the Count is disliked in the Shadow Veil as well. We don't know the status of that. Uh, party makes a deal with Mephistopheles. I don't mm, think any deal nah. was made because no me- meal has happened yet. Gambling time! Nope. Nope. Didn't happen. Uh, Mephistopheles is collecting an item that belongs to a player character in phase one or two. We don't know. Uh, cursed RP. I don't think there was anything cur- particularly cursed. I leave that up uh, to you. Nah. I don't think there was anything cursed. Okay. Have you guys seen this on stream no, or in it. the Discord stream? I, I haven't seen, seen anything oh, it's on Discord. Paused. It's minimized, apparently, Brett. Okay. It's what? Uh, on it's Discord. Discord. This is on Discord. Brett Altimus has minimized their application. Sit tight. I did it, though. Okay, hold on. Maybe I'm streaming the wrong screen. I'm probably streaming my DM view. Hello. Yeah. yeah there you go. I, I tried to do extra effort to make sure I could do this, and uh, whoopsie doodle. <laughs> Uh, no Kopi, I was just listening. Kopi huh. Spirit talks. No, but I have been playing around with some ideas for Kopi Spirit. Uh, I was thinking oh, yeah. of this one. Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, oh, Zero sure. the Bold. It's, it's it is. Zero <laughs> the Bold. Yeah. <laughs> if if that works, let me know. Amazing. If that doesn't, we'll uh, yeah, we'll we'll work on it. Uh, the centaurs <laughs> get captured. We don't know. A path back to the keep is found. No. Technically, I mean. Technically, you found, We've found a, one, yeah, just one solution. One yeah. solution. You're just not pursuing it. So. Yeah. New yeah. Lord of Shadow Lore. We got just the idiotiest, bittiest bits of it, but that's about it. Um. So yeah. I will. I will check that out. Somebody accidentally reveals they're from Io. No. Um, I mean, he accidentally revealed we're from Io. Yeah. Oh, actually, from you Io, know yeah. what? I will count that. I will count that. Uh, Sivos makes an appeal. Sivo. Oh my God. I have so many names. In my freaking head that i have to recall hold on i think i know you're talking about ah yes sivos uh s-i-v-o-z makes an appearance no he is the uh curator the one that is very loud and very oh yeah, yeah. Uh, that, that fellow that was a while ago uh the nearby breach to fey wonders mentioned nope uh rainbow gets deja vu around mephistopheles nope we didn't do any mephistopheles stuff Tantu statue RP. Nope. The gang is betrayed by an ally. No, I would say no to that. Uh, Howie and Olive have a moment together. He tinkered in the bedroom while I slept. What a moment. <laughs> uh, Mephistopheles knows moment. about the curious <laughs> keep and or the count. Uh, we Wait, don't know. Wait, gets deja vu. Why would I get deja vu? Uh, around Mephistopheles. Bonus if Gmart doesn't know why. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just gonna go ahead and check that off. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, I think there's some theories about Mephistopheles that I won't go into right now. Okay, but, I see. But, but yeah, uh, Nat twenty. Uh, yes, there was. Yes, we got Nat was. twenty on uh, QB's role. QB, Did yeah. Copy cope? Many times. Well, to no, get the lack of a, yeah, the lack yeah, of a hospital. No, no hot spring. A die roll, big lore drop excludes uh, LOS lore. LOS, which one's the LOS? Lords of Shadow. Oh, uh, Lords of Shadow lore. Moth? LOS excludes there. Does that count? Oh, uh, yes. I yeah, think that's a bit history. That's a bit. Yeah. We, we got a big lore drop from there. Yeah. So, absolutely. Roll initiative. Nope. Uh, no one rolled a nat one today. I don't yeah, believe. I don't think so. Damn. Well, good day for rolls, bad day for bingo. Good day for rolls, bad <laughs> day for bingo. Well said. Well said indeed. Um, ba, 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 da. okay, let me I'm go. loving it. That's, That's not such what a good singing. reference. That's not what I was singing, dude. Okay. 
Oh, I, I love. You ever just miss it's McDonald's? It's an L day for Brie. Yeah, it's uh. You ever just we we rolled on that one, yeah. Not me. Yeah. Uh, hey, what's up? Hey, oh, that's cheers. badass. Question. Oh, that's how he in his prime. It. Is uh, yeah. UK, England, all that like Europe? Good McDonald's, better McDonald's than uh, the states. Oh, way better, way better. Oh, I'm sorry. Really? McDonald's is better, yeah, based on my. We have much oh. higher uh, food quality food quality standards. standards. Oh yeah, yeah that yeah. makes sense. Yeah. Capitalism. But can I just say I fucking love that Howie in his prime. That looks awesome. Yeah. It's so oh yeah, good. it's very good. Sorry, I got. I was. I had There's a, a gun down at the bottom right, and I feel like there was a gun pose too. Yeah. Maybe. Oh yeah, the eyebrows are the same. It must be. Good shit. I love it. Oh! oh. oh. Is that That's an ice cute. cream? Dude, yeah. one day you'll discover ice cream for the first time. Man. Dude, imagine eating Cannon. ice cream when you're covered in that much fur. Oh no, and that then, doesn't sound very fun. And then That's rough. Tantu smiles. Oh, what's this? Oh! <gasps> oh, it's beautiful. Oh, this is how we make it. the That's Howie. That's how he was born. No he had no, no fur. Eyes. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> Sorry, he no, it was, it's, it's it was such detail. genuine excitement. She was actually I squealing. I appreciate Sorry, it. I got, no, I don't apologize. I, I beautiful. And yeah, I appreciate it very that, much. No, uh, you're good. I just I wanna, that originally drew Howie. So I want to buy all of them. Oh, they're yes. so good. Just let saying. us throw money at you. Yeah, <laughs> they're so good. Winky face. Hey. Remus. Hell yeah. There he goes. There he there goes, goes punching again. just anything okay. again. <laughs> there, there, fucked with there me. There he goes. <laughs> there he goes again. Kev, Kev. Oh yeah, Kev. Thank Glow you. up. Glow, Yasuf. Yas King. Suddenly, Yas. a goose paladin walks by. Hi. Oh my god. All right, new I love my family. Neck I love my family and my orphanage. Uh, <laughs> Why are you orphanage? stabbing me? I forgive you. You can take my <laughs> Later in the arena. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that's, that's about <laughs> right. <laughs> I love the maybe the match. Yeah, no, it really adds to it. That's so yeah. good. That's so good. That's really good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, little, little Pokemon for Tantu. Oh. Oh, it's like the Pokemon that looks most similar to your character. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's cool. That's yeah, the one that like, you were. Or what yeah. your Pokemon would be. Yeah, that, yeah. that yeah. Well, could cool. be like humans having a Mr. Mind. Ooh, I don't know. Gee, well, that's rough. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, dude. It's a little weird. <laughs> I like it. What's wrong? He wanted a cool Pokemon, <laughs> is what he's saying. <laughs> More excuses to draw <laughs> Remo. He does awesome. Smash. That's Damn. great. I love that's that. That's really Mariah. good. That's Mariah. Oh, it's awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 so good. That's spot on. <laughs> Time to sleep. Aww. We're such a sleepy group. I know we are. You're really late, IRL. Yeah. Oh, who the heck is this? Oh, oh my god. That's the person Jesus. that's about to ruin your life. Yeah. <laughs> As a knife smile. Oh my god. Can we just. Oh my god. Whoa. That's so is, that is that Mackie Deals? Is that. Wait. 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 How did we wait. do the. Wait. How, wait. That, McDonald's. Wait. How did they do that so But that. No, no, no. Bree. Bree. That was. That was before we brought up McDonald's. Wait, oh. what? It's what prediction the fuck? play. Serendipitous. What? Oh, wait, That's no. So weird. Because no, it's actually requested, McClern. Tantu got a McClern meal. Oh, I see. There it is. Oh, I mean, but still, serendipitous. Yeah. Also, your character, like the way you draw poses, really. I good. love it. So expressive. Hey, so bad news, everyone. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Bro, what I'm the leaving fuck? this call. I'm I, 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 I,
screen. Dude, Can you show the second me. slide again? Uh, he does it for me. It's how everyone well, hyped up the first slide. Like, oh, it's so cute. It's I so love it. So All right. Then next, I wanted was a dog artwork? today to make me feel better, like uh, a, a therapy dog. I just and you said say, no. <laughs> the meme potential of these two images. Yeah. Just saying, community. The meme yeah, potential. Yeah. All right. Put those, you put those subtitles on you, it, please. You, yeah, you yeah, heard. Yeah. You heard this here first. Uh, Bree would like memes. Olive to be as, carried as, around uh, some McDonald's and then dropping it and being very sad. That's what Bree is. my character, though. Yeah, but do it no, for if, Bree. If the artist is okay with it, the meme potential of it's like good. putting text over this is it's good. It's it's, it's uh, very good. good. Anyways, I'm gonna I'm gonna end this fan art right now before stripping ends. Uh, you my, on my friendship. Yeah, exactly. It ends our friendship. So, <laughs> right, you didn't even let me have a therapy dog today. You're like, it'll show up later. <laughs> a, a therapy it... like shadow realm horse i don't mm -hmm. know man yeah dude mm -hmm. i needed it well that's i i'm i wanted to that's why i was telling you i'm setting aside some time so that way we can do it so it doesn't feel rushed bud i'm looking out for you bud all right uh that's it uh I'm, Damn, where I'm... you gonna ride your horse huh inside the castle bro i'm like yeah. three foot tall. it wouldn't take any more space than you it's, well, a it's a pony. Horse? It's a Highland pony. It's a real ass horse. I don't think it's like a raccoon sized horse. No, get him a small one. It's little. Oh my god, yes. Give him a tiny little pony. Get him a little really Highland pony. A wait, little wait, one wait. With, like like um, little Sebastian. Uh, a Shetland pony? Already, from Elden Ring. We've wow, already planned friend. it out, guys. It'll happen. Oh, okay. I just wanted to make sure okay. that there was a moment where it could happen and it wasn't rushed through. I want to. So you don't care about our input, though? About our input of a sound. Your input of character someone else's lore. character? No, yeah. I don't. I really don't. What? What? It's kind of a party decision. The, it's kind of a it's kind of a character decision. I, I, re like, I request I a move group. That. I want to transfer. I want a group transfer. You, no, you can't transfer groups. You're in the shadow veil. This is why I put you here. Well, you the, can't the, transfer. There's three groups in the shadow veil right now. This is an easy handover. Hey, oh hey, 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 bye bye. Wait, could it be a centaur? <laughs> could it be like a centaur? <laughs> Stop. That would be pretty cursed. All right, we got the cursed at RP Bingo. Would hate it. All yeah. right, uh, guys, I will be. We we will be back next Tuesday. Sound good? Yeah. Yeah. See yeah. You then. yeah. 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 All right. Good. Have a good one, guys. Bye, Thanks again. Bye bye. bye. bye.